Hello, Rosaders! Time for cardio. No, I don't think so. How long would he run in? I'm gonna get that delicious last slice of pizza. You better believe it. What's up, gamers? What are we up to today? How are we feeling? How are we, how are we looking? How are we living? How are we uh, vi vibing? Yeah, let's say that. Sure. Wait, my music got mad quiet. Hold on. Oh, there we go. We're feeling French today, huh? Oh, hui hui. As the French would say, um, pathetic. <laughs> I don't know any French. Uh, I know, uh, parlez-vous français? And, um, uh, that, that's probably it. Anyway, thank you for the, uh, gifted, uh, memberships earlier. I did see that. And thank you for the delicious, delicious soup. I realized it's 3 a.m. when I saw you live streaming. Good night, you in. Sleep well. Or sleep poorly. That's all on you. Welcome in, Marina. Omelette de fromage? Uh, sure, yeah. 1% fluent in French? I'm already halfway there, baby. I'm already halfway there. Parlez-vous français means you speak French. Oh, I know what it means. Uh, I just don't do it. Uh, this is Linguin Romai. Hello, and good night, Will. French tisker? That's how I do. Je suis un croissant. <laughs> Thank you for the five gifted memberships, Mari. Are you trying to snuck? Ah, I see what you're doing. I see what's going on. I understand. You're very brave. <laughs> oh, and thank you for the great thumbnail art. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, comment, cava uh, monsieur? I don't know what that means, but I should probably stop reading random French, or I'm going to say something I really shouldn't say, huh? Uh, minion, lethety. Uh, oui. Passez une bonne journée. Bruce. Rosé. <laughs> Crimson Rosé, my evil French counterpart, and the one who was supposed to be an Armus. He wore a suit like the other Armus boys. I just, you know, I beat his ass and I joined before he could. <laughs> I'm not reading that one. I see you, Captain Obvious. I don't know what it says, but I don't want to know. Oh, shit, really? Yep, yep. Yeah, evil, evil ruse be like, dresses formally, <laughs> is very polite, uh, talks with like, uh, uh, fucking sounds like an e-boy. Hey everyone, welcome to my stream. My name's Evil Ruse. Thanks for being here. <laughs> Thank you very much for the gifted, uh, membership and the delicious soup. Sure that's the evil one? Yeah, that's the evil one. He's also like, I love everyone. Equally. <laughs> and I'm like, get out of here, you little parasocial prick. <laughs> I stopped him. I saved you from him. You're actually welcome. You're welcome. I protected you from evil ruse. Evil ruse is bad. <laughs> Why do you sound like, uh-oh. That's not who I was going. That's not Altair. Altair's like, wow. He's like really airy, like really soft. It's not like, <laughs> hey, everyone. It's more like a soft, like sort of like, uh, Wow. Hi, everyone. Like, like his is, like, really, like, very, very breathy. Very good. Very nice. It's very good. Altair's natural speaking voice is just really, like, uh, cloudy, I guess. Or, like, sort of, like, I don't know how to describe it. Breathy is probably the best I got. Evil Ruse is a polite surfer, dude. Uh-oh. Yeah, it's like, like a bedtime story. Or, like, just a really, like, charming person approaching you. How disgusting is that? Imagine being charming and having a high charisma score. <laughs> I'm going to swerve over to Evil Ruse. Oh, don't do that. It's a terrible idea. Dangerous. It's a dangerous world that we're going to live in. Anyway, how's everybody doing today? What are we up to besides being French? What are we what are we living with? What are we what are we rocking today? I just uh, I had a couple delicious pizza rolls. Thank you Naru for the mm -mm -mm soup. My first language is JP and second is French. Wow, very cool. Bon, bon journée. Have a good day. Oh, oh no. Bonjour. 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 No, it's bonjour, right? Bonjour. I don't know. Anyway, congrats. The fact that you know three languages is wild. I'm existing. I'm doing all right. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I was watching uh, a bunch of TikTok about five minutes up until stream because I'm a... I, I have no self-control, and I should have been prepping for stream, but instead I sat there and I watched uh, TikTok, so 
Recovering from Valorant matches? I played my first Valorant match in like a month yesterday, actually. Um, and I was watching TikTok earlier. Shit, sorry. I got I got off a tangent again. I was watching TikTok earlier, and I kept coming across that audio, and I love it because it reminds me of the other boys trying to get me to take care of myself. And it's like, poor Armus is like, you're not ascending to godhood. You're just dehydrated. And I'm like, out of my way, gay boy. I'm about to liberate myself from this divine shell. And I'm like, I pass out from, you know, not having any water for three years. And I'm like, uh, hospital. <laughs> Who do I main in Valorant? Uh, Omen or Sova. I love that audio so much. It makes me so happy. <laughs> I am not a Zoomer, goddammit. It's very Ruse core. <laughs> you look like a Sova main. How dare you say that to me? No, I've been playing a lot of... Um, I was playing a lot of Deadlock before I stopped playing, and I play a ton of Omen, an okay amount of Sova. Uh, I tried to pick up KO. That's about it. I don't really play Duelist, but that's about all that I avoid. Well, I play Yoru sometimes. You're a millennial for real, for real? I'm not a millennial. I'm like a big boomer. I'm the biggest of boomers. I'm, I'm, I'm older than the boomers themselves. Omen is fun. I love Omen. Omen's just like Reaper, right? Like repositioning. What is it, Omen quote? What's he say? He's always like, uh, um, I don't remember anymore. You know what it is. Yeah, I'm the elder boomer. I'm beyond boomer. Can't fool us dinosaurs. Ruse. I'm not a baby. I'm so old, dude. Anyway, older than Shinri, significantly. Omen positioning, yeah, it's the same thing. You do a good Reaper? I don't know if I could do a good Reaper. I could try. The Ascended. Greetings. Nah, I don't know about that. I'm 30. I'm like thousands of years old. I'm way older than that. How dare you say that to me? How dare you? <laughs> I ain't no baby. I ain't no 30-year-old. <laughs> One of your senpais is over 5,000 years old. Are you older than that? I'm a normal average human age. So, yes, of course I am. Duh. Am I older than Flayon? Yeah, probably. I'm, I'm 413. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I am not homestuck age. Uh, I'm at least two years old. No, that's not true, actually. I'm technically a month old right now. Baby Gerard, baby Octavio, and baby Roos. I'm not a baby! Uh, anyway, we're not talking about this. I'm done talking about that. It's not important. I was waiting. Yeah, I was. Hold on. Let me get a little sip of my drink here. One second. Ah. Uh, half, huh? I don't know what you're talking about. What does that mean? Okay, Zoomer. Whatever you say, Zoomer. How dare you, Wings of Hope. But thank you for the soup. Gonna get a bone stolen soon. Wish me luck. Good luck, Lizzie. Right now, I'm drinking off-brand Baja Blast, which is to say I'm drinking Sprite mixed with uh, energy powder. But it's like a strawberry and... Um, I think it's like strawberry and kiwi flavor. So it tastes like Baja Blast. It's pretty good. Mm -mm -mm. It's pretty good. The flavor I'm drinking, I'm not going to tell you the brand because I don't want this to be product placement, and I can't technically say uh what it is because covers not like you know sponsored or anything but i'm drinking the flavor and you can find this yourself by looking it up um guacamole gamer farts 9000 oh you didn't miss much delicious strawberry in the blood of my enemies mm -mm -mm. base base taste thank you it's very good uh, I've actually never watched Badger, but I might now. I might now. I just like the flavor. I am not sponsored. That's true. I am not. Sasuga, baby. Don't you Sasuga me. I am uh, Kuai. <laughs> I'm learning. I'm learning words. I'm getting very. I'm getting very smart now. My brain's getting massive. It's expanding. It's getting um. Um. Oishi? No, is that delicious or is that big? That's delicious, I think. Not Oishi. It's getting... No, 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 Not kawaii. Kuai. Kawaii. Yeah, kawaii. No, my brain's not getting delicious. Hmm. There's a word for it, but I can't remember anymore. 
Mr. Kai? Hey, Mr. Kai. Oki? I think it's Oki. That's what I was thinking of. Oki. Yeah, that's what I was thinking of. Yeah. Uh, I did not mean smart, but thank you. All right, hold on. Let me finish this drink and we'll get started. I'll tell you about what we're going to do today and then we'll get rocking. Yeah. No, how dare you? Hi, hi. Uh, uh, my brain is Okina. <laughs> I hope I'm doing that right. Ah. That's all right. If I'm doing it wrong, that's part of the learning process, baby. Okay, we are all good. Nice. So, what I am going to be doing today... What we are going to be doing today, what we are going to participate in together, and by together, I mean you must stay 10 feet away from me at all times and watch in hushed reverence as I show you Dragon's Dogma. You got that dogma in him. Uh, I'm going to be playing a little bit of Dragon's Dogma. It is an action RPG with combat that is akin to something like Monster Hunter or Dark Souls if they had a baby. Um, and it's set in a sort of dark Western fantasy themed world. It's very fun. It's got great action combat and maybe the best there ever was. Uh, so yeah, we're going to do that. Get ready. When last we left off, we had just met, uh, Mercedes, who is aggressively French. Uh, so, you know, um, uh, bon, bon, bonjour. Bonjourno, or, or something like that. Yep, that's right. Uh, does this version have the rocking opening? I don't know. Probably not. I think it's very much like... Uh, I think it's more like... Chanting. Like a lady singing opening. Anyway, she's aggressively French. Um, and she's pretty cool. And we're going to go to the capital with her. But first, we're doing side quests. We just saved our childhood friend from getting lost in the woods and dying to giant spiders or wolves. Uh, and we asked a witch for advice, and she said she doesn't know. We'll have to go talk to the church. So I'm guessing that is a hint that the church is evil. I know, <laughs> an RPG where the church is evil? Whoa! Don't get wild now! Whoa! Man, don't pull too close to real life. <laughs> What's a twist? Uh, is the Rosader Pawn... Doing okay? Yeah, I think so. I haven't thrown the Rosator Pawn over a cliff or anything yet. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. If you, if you <laughs> the church is probably maybe not evil. It's hard for an entity like that to be evil. Individuals are evil. Usually not a whole organization. But anyway, uh, he hates us. Yes. Yes, that is true. I'm not going to throw you off a cliff yet. Yet. Um, Give it time. So yeah, where was I? Oh yeah, I'm gonna pull up the game. Duh. <laughs> I'm like, what am I doing? How do I? Oh, I'm streaming. Oh, okay. Wait, I want to be thrown off a clip, a clip or a cliff. Throw us, coward! Oh, don't test me. Don't test me. I'll do a solo run. I don't need any pawns where I'm going. All right, so I need to turn down this audio just in case it gets way too loud. And then I need to swap over to this and. Oh, you don't think I will? Well, I'll show you. Listen, you bunch of chuckle fucks. Relax for a second. I will. Maybe. Eventually. No, you may not sit on my head and have snacks. What do you think this is? A game? Hmm. A throw pawn counter would be pretty cool, actually. I should do that. I gotta launch this in offline mode. Just in case. And let's see if this is loading in the right place at the right time. Uh, uh, I should probably take, oh yeah, we bought a new outfit last we left off. Okay, not bad. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Hopefully everything's working here. Turn up our audio some. Uh. What are you, Link? Why are you making sounds like that, dude? Pop this off so we can see what we're doing. Fashion's Dogma. 
You know. That's an iffy shield stance, but at least he holds his shield close to his body and in front of him. That's actually not terrible. Uh, I will say that our character doesn't have as strong a jaw as I would like. The jaw is a little weak comparatively. I mean, look at look at my jaw. Look at look at this jawline. It's not bad though. It's tolerable. It's tolerable. It, it'll work once we get it. Once we get a helmet on, we'll be fine. Yeah, we know baby face. Dang, does he need some water? Yup, he's thirsty. Oh, that's right. We were gonna help this bard lady who was trying to riz me up and failing, might I add. Hey, your riz attempts are pathetic. You're gonna have to try a little harder than that. You're gonna have to sneak up on me in the woods like a like a mystical elf and surprise me with a sword to the throat. <laughs> Do you now see that the fates brought us together? No, they didn't. And what a chance it is to protect so fair a maiden in her hour of need. Oh, God. Uh, man, the temptation to, like, just take your coin purse and leave is really high right now. But, uh, <sighs> sure. I guess it would be wrong of me to pass up somebody in need. Only a fool could mistake the thread of destiny what links us. If you say one more parasocial thing, I'm putting you in the ocean. You Shut up! True. And after me, the world entire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We must be off. I trust you know of the encampment outside the village. I do. I do. I must travel there with all speed, but the wilds are perilous of late. If being insufferable was like a crime I could punish, I would call the guards right would now. You see me there safely. Yes! Come on! Stop talking and run! Let's go! Thank you. How fair. <laughs> you know what? I'm doing pretty good. Thank you for asking. Anyway, where were we? Everything in this game can be solved with a yeet. True. It's this game is right. All right, come on. Wait, why are you wounded already? What'd you get hurt by? I'll heal your wounds. You dumb motherfucker. What did you run into? All right, anyway. Can we hurry up? I've got places to go. Not even the saltiest fisherman. You guys are talking over each other. Chill. What? Gold? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Hey! Where are you going? Stick with me. Do you want to live? Bam! Damn, that music kind of swelling right there. Are you okay, music? There's art here. <sighs> I mean, shit, I guess I can't complain too much. I do that too. Take a little water with me. For later. Aha, gold. I love that I could be your personal bodyguard while you stand around and loot junk. Yeah, escort mission. Ugh. Let's go, lesbians! Let's go! You hear goblins Ooh, chanting? There's art here. I do. Come on. Oh my god, are you gonna stop up and pick stop? Oh my god. She, I'm gonna lose my mind. She's stopping to pick up every rusty penny she finds on the ground. This is absolutely bonkers, dude. We'll find ore among the crags that litter this place. Not interested. Aha, gold. I hate you so much. <laughs> there's a fine treat. I've had enough. I've had enough. We're leaving. Jeez. Finally. <laughs> what that ruse doing? Your fine work. We'd best be inside, don't you think? Yeah, let's go inside. You're welcome. What can I say except please don't ever talk to me again? Give me my reward. This may sound untoward, but exactly, Morax. <laughs> Thank you for the soup. Have you aught in the way of coin? I'm 
sorry. I'm sorry, par pardon me? I j Did I just save your life for you to ask me if I have coin? <sighs> no. No, I don't. Thank you for asking. I'm gonna kill her. I'm gonna kill her. Will you spare some gold? A thousand good. Well, you of course. At some point, most likely. Uh. Who said I could fix her? I don't think you could fix her. I could fix her by tossing her off a cliff. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, you know what? I understand the poor plight. Here you go, asshole. Get out of here. Shut the fuck up. Don't ever say that again. I swear. Ooh. Oh, you're testing me. A woman's heart is a dangerous creature. But in don't ever talk to me. Has it been said, a poor life is a happy one. I have never found this to be true. Me neither. If ever fortune sees you to Grand Soren and me to setting up my shop, you must come visit. I shall even give you a discount. Okay. Alright, where's my discount? What do you got? Oh, that sucks. What else you got? That sucks. What else you got? Any weapons? No. Mm, no. Man, you, you're out. Your shit sucks. Wait, that's what I have. What do you have? I want to buy something from you. What? Are you letting me buy or are you s weird? Anyway, whatever. Thank you very much. I feel more Mercedes, am I ready to take on your quest? I can't remember. Let's check our journal and make sure we don't have any quest outstanding before we go to Mercedes. Uh oh. Cyclopses, undead warriors, phantasms, seabirds. Most of these are whatever. Report back to Elvar. 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 What was I doing with Elvar? Hmm. Who's Elvar? Mercedes is pretty. I'm not going to lie. Between uh, what's her fuck McGee and Mercedes? Mercedes forever. Mercedes looks like she could take. She, she could fight. She could fight. And that's cool as hell. Competence is cool as hell. Plus, she's got a cool accent. And a cool design. I mean, look at that outfit. That's sick. Look at that cape. God damn. Hey, cool hammer, dude. Loving the He-Man outfit. Um, Let's see. Who are we going to talk to? There's some guy named Elvar I was supposed to deliver news for? Elvar. Was he back in the main town? If you find combat a struggle... It may behoove you to adjust your party. Not right now, Rosaders! If confidence is cool, Gerard's gonna be so disappointed. Yeah, Gerard would be real disappointed. I'm not gonna lie. What's that Spike Spiegel fucking line? Uh, I love a woman who can kick my ass. <laughs> Ugh, I think it's back at the main town. Let's go back to the main town. Facts. Yup. True. <laughs> Sturdy, this place. Far east off the map. Really? Why would Elvar be... What? No shot. Over here? No, he's got to be a Casardis, because I haven't been anywhere else. I've been in the Witchwood, I've been to this fort, and I need to go to the main city. But I assume Elvar's got to be a Casardis, because I haven't been anywhere else. The Duke could stand to commission some new roads. <laughs> He's just like me for real, for real. Witchwood again? Oh, the Witchwood. Reese's cut! Reese's cut! Eat him up, eat him up, eat him up! Ah, 
live in me. Welcome into the Rosetta. <laughs> Thank you, and welcome in. Yeah, well, it's Reese's Cups now. All right, I know it's Puffs. Leave it alone. I had to make the joke because the name was right there. Leave me alone. Yes, I know. Thank you, Alicia. Is it Alicia or is that Alyssa? Hmm. Hmm. Can you make an entire karaoke of just meme songs? Yeah, I got you. No problem. What's another good meme song? Uh. 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 Fuck. Uh. Uh. Is your hometown? Is it not? Welcome to the internet. Have a look around. One, two, a buckle my shoe. <laughs> Freebird? Does that count? I don't even know. I don't know the lyrics to Freebird, unfortunately. I've only heard it in the context of memes. Trommies? All right, so Elvar's got to be... Can I... Is there, like, a way to check... NPCs? Fisherman? No, okay. So there's... Oh, wait. There's a way to check quests, though. Notice board. Knowledge chair. What the fuck's a knowledge chair? I don't think Elvar's gonna be down here. I think he's gonna be in a house somewhere. Let's go look around. Good good find, Alicia. Um, Bakamitai? Oh, yeah. Bakamitai. I think I've sung that before, but I don't really know. Maybe I haven't, actually, because I feel like I would remember the lyrics a little bit. I just remember the dumb at uh, 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 We wanna know. Sir, I would pay money for your concert. I mean, like, how much? <laughs> Thank you for the soup. Uh, don't count on it, but uh, well, maybe. Uh, keep an eye out one day, maybe. Lauchi, welcome in. Uh, hey. Nice rack. Says Kosaurus Rex. Hey, you. I just saved you from the forest, remember? To see those who fled the dragon even now return. Membership carry. Ooh, I don't know about that. I'd have to really think about what songs I'm allowed to sing. Also, isn't. I don't think you could do unarchived memberships, can you? Because there's no shot I'm doing an archive karaoke. One, because I don't need records of my incredible failures. Uh, two, I don't really think I know enough songs. Uh, Honestly, I don't know any songs in Japanese. You know what song I'd really want to be able to sing one day? Is um, Karma by Bump of Chicken. That would go hard. Oh! You can? Oh, you can. Huh. Interesting. I don't know if I have the voice for Karma, but I would like to sing that. What other songs would I want to sing? Uh, What's that one? There's a song from... Um, God damn it, I always forget the name of the band. And the name of the song. Uh, it's from... It's, I actually saw it in like an A and B when I was a kid and fell in love with this song. And I can't remember the fucking name of it. Uh, separate Ways. Separate... Uh, 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 journey. Journey. Separate Ways. Journey. Yeah. Yeah. That song goes hard. Man, that dude's vocals are nuts. Oh, new quest. Okay. I usually just take those because it's usually just kill X amount of creature quests. And they auto-complete if you do it. So why not? Elvar's got to be around here somewhere, right? Need a glow stick emote before karaoke? You'll just have to use uh, the run emote with Zephyr. It'll, it'll communicate it well enough. <laughs> run. Yeah, journey songs are intense. That's like a far away goal. Like a one day, if I ever learn to sing, I'd like to sing some journey. Or at least that song. I don't know if I know enough journey, like, music to sing those. Ooh, and I want to do, uh, man, everything I like, cause every music I learn of or consume is because of memes or fucking media. But I want to do Master of Puppets because I saw it in that uh, season of Stranger Things. And I was like, whoa! Whoa! As Mario might say. Whoa! <laughs> oh, you! I didn't know I had to turn the quest back into you, dude. Polish Cow? I don't know that song. Is that the one with the cow that's kind of like... Uh, stock, stock image cow just kind of rocking back and forth that I saw in VR chat all over the place. I live the best I am able for his sake. I'm glad to hear it, bud. Good for you. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. We're done. Our quests are done. What do you want? Cortez's grave stands by the chapel. 
Perhaps we've time to pay our respects. Oh, okay, sure. Yeah, I guess you know something about this quest. I don't. Join me for a drink. No, Rorik, not right now. I'm going to pay my respects to somebody I don't know or care about. Greetings. Silence. Okay, by the chapel. Where's Cortez's grave? Oh, cool. Let's steal all the herbs around his grave. Oh, yeah, baby. Now we're cooking. Nirvana? I know a little bit of Nirvana songs. My dad loves Nirvana. Um, um, like Teen Spirit, right? Or, uh, fuck, um. Uh, I know there's other ones. I know there's other ones. Ooh, running up that hill would go so hard. There's no shot I could do that, but I would want to. That rock cover of it. Ow! Shit! My legs! Yeah. Ooh, Guns N' Roses. Maybe. I don't know if I know any Guns N' Roses music, but I'd like to try. I could do Welcome to the Jungle. See, as long as I keep these below uh, three seconds, I think I'm allowed to reference these things. But I, I, the only part of Welcome to the Jungle I know at all is... Welcome to the jungle! What a <laughs> 50 gold? That's cheap. This guy loves to let me rest here for cheap, and I love that for him. Thank you. Oh, yeah! That one. I remember that from uh, Burnout, I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man, a lot of this is like what I what I would call dad rock, and I don't mean it's like necessarily old rock. It's just a lot of stuff I grew up hearing, like from my from like my dad's radio and shit when he's working on stuff. Guitar Hero Karaoke. <laughs> Every rose has its thorns. I don't know that song in and out, but I know of that song. Like I know the chorus of that. I believe um, it's either that or it's gonna be a uh, kiss by a rose. <laughs> I hate how quick my stamina runs out. Welcome in, Rosader. I'm going to say that's Case Caddy and not Casey Caddy. Do I know Diggy Hole? I know the... Uh, I am a dwarf and I'm digging. A yeah. I don't hear you take a crack at Linkin Park. I do not think I could match uh, the vocalist for Linkin Park, but I could certainly give it a shot. I have the tiger. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Maybe. Uh, I don't know if there's anything to increase stamina. I know there's classes that have higher stamina, like the Strider class with the dual daggers and the bow has higher stamina. Um, the warrior class, that I, or fighter class I'm playing right now has higher carry capacity. So I can carry more loot and pick people up and stuff like that. That's a metal cover? Ooh, I want to do uh, Misty Mountain. Mmm. -hmm. Yeah. Folk music. What kind of folk music are we talking about? Are you talking about like folk metal or folk, like folk folk? Phantom of the Opera. I don't know that I have the voice for operatic music, but I would definitely give it a shot. I'm going to take tips from Octavio for that one. Anjovi. Possibly. Wellerman. Everybody knows Wellerman. If you've been on TikTok, you know Wellerman. I guess I'm done now, right? Like, I'm good to go. I could probably leave this place. I think I've done all the side quests I can do. I went to the Witchwood. Um, I could. I could, real quick. If we wanted to do a little side quest, I could run down to... Hey, no. Um, I could run down to this area, and then there's a little side, like, fort over here. And I don't know if that has anything to do with any quests or not. But I could go there before I head to the main area. The idea of your guy prattling off about dad rock songs while traversing the land and questing is such a fun mental image for me, as, as it should be hip hop prey. That sounds hilarious. Just chattering with his. Just chatter, ch the, you are the Rosaders. We're walking together talking about dumb music. Yeah, it's a song from The Hobbit, Hex Fan. Oh, I see. Sea shanties? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any video game songs you would sing? I don't typically listen to video games with vocals. 
uh, video game OSTs, the vocals. Most of the video game music I like is just uh, musical. Um, I'm trying to think if there's any... Oh, uh, maybe some Sonic Adventure 2 tracks or Sonic Heroes. Uh, like, I would do... Um, ooh, I would do some Shadow the Hedgehog covers. <laughs> uh, I could do... Uh, is there any Sonic the Hedgehog covers I could think of? Uh, maybe all of me, um, uh, live and learn, um, mm. I don't remember what else. Yeah, Crush 40. Oh, what's that song from uh, Sonic 06? I never played Sonic 06, but I love, I love the, 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 the theme song to it. Wait, am I going to that fort or not? Do we want to go do the side quest at the fort? Is there a side quest there? I wonder if there's a quest later and I'd be wasting my time. Ooh, Sonic R also has good tracks, yeah. Everybody's super Sonic. Yeah, his world. That one goes hard. Oh, I would do his world. Yeah, go to the fort. Okay, we'll go to the fort. Fuck it. I think that's this way, if I remember correctly. <laughs> you should see how much I talk with my hands, Neon Violet, when I, when I, when I have the capability. You will, uh, you will be annoyed and amazed. <laughs> You'll be both amazed and tired of dealing with it when I'm waving my hands all over the place. This encampment serves as a fine bulwark against monsters. Oh, uh, so I may as well go to the main city first? Okay, Axe Priest, fair enough. Thank you. Have I heard Sonic Frontier songs? No. Uh, Sonic Riders I had for a very short time. I believe it was, I rented it or something like that. Or maybe my parents rented it for me. Um, I don't know any of the music from it, really. Remember that wolves hunt in packs, and goblins ill like fire. We are a vagabond people, born in a the encampment was a humble enough place before the attack. Now Wait, where? Where's Mercedes? Mercedes! Oh, hi. What's up? Sorry, I definitely wasn't uh, panicking or anything. <laughs> I'm competent. I. <laughs> you will need your strength. <laughs> Good. Undefeatable from Sonic Frontiers. I'll take a look. Good luck, Fur Tree. It will be slow going with a cart. I dare say you will have no trouble catching up. Thank you. We'll meet at the way castle. Till then, I bid you rest well. Thank you. Uh, head for the mountain way castle and help her escort it. Okay. I don't know a lot about Mercedes, but she seems pretty cool. To keep out goblins, I should think. Yes, I know a Rusaders. Thank you. She's Jean de Arc coded. Yeah, she kind of is, huh? All right, where is this wagon? Silence! Casca. I've never actually uh, read Berserk. It's quite a pleasant corner. But I know who you're talking about. The road splits now. Let's be doubly Ready. sure. Is that a bandit? Are you serious right now? Are you actually banditing right here on the main road? Oh, you dumb as fuck. For real, for real. Holy shit. Nice try, baby. No, 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 no. You started this. You hold still. You wanted this. Remember that. Wait, wrong button. Where's my... There it is. Wah -bah -bah -bah. Hi. <laughs> is everybody dead? Are we good? Okay, cool. Nope, not quite. There's a button I'm supposed to be pushing. There we go. Oh! Did I just impale him? I did. I impaled him. Yucky. That is the least respectful thing I've ever heard anybody say, Shaco from League of Legends. However... You're not technically wrong. How could you say something so controversial yet so true? What's that? What the hell? Don't do it, dude. You really don't want to do it. Okay. Sorry about that. <laughs> Told you not to do it, though, to be fair. 
I feel like my button uh, keys have changed since last time I played, and that's really weird. But so be it. There's left we might have use ska, huh? I don't really listen to a lot of ska music, but I, I, from what I have listened to, I do enjoy it. It's very fun. It's very upbeat music. Thank you for the uh, super. Mmm, soup. What is up this way, I wonder? Are you bad? Nah, you're chill. Ah, welcome in, Mermaid Scales. Crusaders are now 12. Woo! A sorcerer master. Stay vigilant. Bro, can you guys please just relax? I'll go kill them. Okay, hi. Hey, what's up? Oh, ah! Don't do that. You're being so weird right now, dude. What's up, baby? One more? Ah! <laughs> Spicy. Next. Go ahead, shoot me. No, no, I, I insist. Shoot me, friend. Don't run for me. Stop that. Stop that, I said. Bye. <laughs> the way he went flying, man. Thanks for the heal, bud. Ooh, a rock. We love throwing rocks. Shadow Wizard Ruse Gang. We love tossing rocks. Okay, so this is my sword skills. These are my shield skills. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, I remember now. Oh, you have a salet. I want a salet. Wait, you're really like. Kind of melted looking under there. Sure. Are you okay? Oh, no. It's like clothing. Okay. I was like, whoa. Is that a hollow from Dark Souls? We love eating. Hey, what's up there? Oh, is that the wagon? I think I'm actually heading the right way. Maybe I, by breaking off, I went the correct path. Yep. I went the right way on accident. We love that. Oops. Almost lost my stamina. Uh, probably birdie, but I have not gotten word back from management yet about whether or not I'm allowed to do that. So we will see. The stone makes a regrettably effective wall. Hello, Mercedes and peasants. Hello, peasantry. Guardsmen, guardsmen, guardsmen. Mustachioed guardsmen. <laughs> 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 Oh, my bad, dude. That was an accident. Accident, accident guys. Accident. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You made it. Good. Mmm. I hope you're excited for it because I'm excited to try it out. I'm curious what I'm going to do with some people. Like, trying to get a good class for Gerard and Goldie are probably going to be the hardest. Obviously, Octavio could fit very nicely into, like, a very control-oriented uh, bard. But uh, Goldie and Gerard are going to be a little harder to place. Throws you on accident. <laughs> Capital men. Like as not, the cart will draw beasts along the way. Stay vigilant, but fear not. We walk with the Arisen, slayer of Hydras. Well, Wolf Rain, it depends on what you're doing, right? Like, if you're an indie, I mean, a lot of those rules don't necessarily apply, so uh, don't be afraid of it. You know, do what you want. Follow your creative pursuits. Would Pathfinder classes work? Um, no, probably not, because I don't know much about Pathfinder. First edition. Second edition doesn't have enough classes to, like, really differentiate it a ton. I mean, they have the Alchemist, which is different. But otherwise, a lot of them are pretty similar uh, to 5e, at least at the moment. Unless there's already an expansion of Pathfinder second edition that I don't know of. Gerard seems like a barbarian. Mm, I wouldn't place Gerard on a strength build, really. Hey guys, what are you doing right outside this fort? What's that about? Hey friend! Wah! Sit down. Hmm, warm what's that? Grand Soren stands beyond this way camp. What's that? 
I would say Goldie is probably a uh, ranger. Gerard could work as a warlock. Rogue is if you want, but possible. I would say warlock wouldn't be bad, but I feel like Gerard is actively avoiding a sort of warlock pact by leaving his family behind. Therefore, uh, symbolically leaving behind is source of power, like choosing not to take a pact. Uh, happy holidays, Ruru. Can't be your glucose guardian, but I can be your fructose friend. <laughs> Uh, might be joining Rain since I'm dealing with a lot. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Shaka. Sorry to hear that. But uh, you're allowed to hate me. It's okay. We cannot allow in flight. That being said, I hope everything. Uh, I hope everything pans out. Oh shit! It just stole the Rusaders. Hey, hey! Only I get to throw the Rusader. Oh, ouchies! Come back here. Nobody gets to do that but me. Sit down. Hey! It it I'll pin it down, kill it! <laughs> Did it. No nice. Anyway, thank you for the delicious soup, Shaco. I'm sorry to hear about that. Uh, I hope everything's going well, though. I mean, as well as it can. Obviously, that's not well, but... Goldie possibly sharpshoot a rogue. I could see Goldie being a very long range ranger that takes the uh, marksman feat, maybe the one that allows you to shoot uh, even further using a longbow or a heavy crossbow. And oh, hey, what's up? But anyway, not that big a deal. I'll talk about it later. How about that? Let's save that for an actual like. Let's save our theory crafting for the stream itself. How's that sound? Oh, for fuck's sake! See. Oh, I've only had a bow. Hey, you want to shoot him down or no? Oh, good catch, by the way, Clark. Oh my gosh. That was clean. Ow. Yeah, yeah, put him down. Go, 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 go. Wolves? What the fuck are wolves doing out here now? Harpies? Wolves? What's wrong with these roads, man? You guys got to clean up your roads. Oh, sorry, Mercedes. Sorry, Mercedes. Wrong button. <laughs> Surprise. A hug. <laughs> Okay, why are you yelling at me, Rosader? Do it if you got it. God damn it. Ah! Says you. Ah! Come back here, cowards. Fine, be afraid. Eat this! Bonk! <laughs> Give me that. Sit down. Okay, anyway. Um, probably just player handbook to answer your question, but I'm not sure yet. We'll see. We'll see. Say, Roos, been an entire month since your debut. How do you feel about being a member of Armist and streaming in general? Uh... Well, since Armus begged me to lead them and uh, be the only competent member, I guess I feel like it's somewhat my responsibility to make sure they don't walk off a cliff limbing style and just, uh, you know, nose to ass, send themselves to their grave. So... Exhausted. <laughs> no, it's okay, I guess. They're all right. Um, it has its ups and its downs. Streaming's cool. Streaming's interesting. Not exactly where I saw myself at this point in life, but here we are, you know, making the best of it, surviving, vibing. Ooh, tasty. Get down here, you won't. Ooh, got him with a fire. Damn, I really be putting my whole Rusissi out there. Rock slide? Where? What? Oh, up here? I ain't afraid of no rock. I'm a little afraid of that rock. Uh, maybe it's okay. What's that? Hey, hey, nice! That's a freebie. Let's go, gamers. We gotta get away from that rock before it slides. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, 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 come on. What does? Oh, we came down that way, okay. Hey guys, I'm gonna go check out this little hut, so just wait right there for me. Oh, I'm tired. Hey guys, I'm tired. Can I get some help? Thank you. Please never say that again. Oh yeah, my bad. <laughs> I 
A mountain cottage. Anybody up here? Oh, you're actually... There's people here. What's up? Okay. Can I have some of this? You guys don't mind if I take your coin pouch, do you? What are you guys talking about? Oh. Oh, no, the cart! No! Well. It's... Oh, it just broke. The cart's stronger. Never mind. Do you want to rock? You damn bird. Sit down. Okay, is there anything up here of worth? Not really. Let's head back down to get to this cart, shall we? Mm -mm -mm. It's true. As far as I know, there are no pets or mounts in Dragon's Dogma. I could be wrong. I may well be wrong. But as far as I know, no. Hello, boink. Thanks for the pinion. Oh, man, our cow really got messed up. Hey, you want to heal our cow? Heal our cow, Crusaders. Hey, welcome in, Just John. John? John. <laughs> hey, nice eye. Good job watching out with that rock. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Ooh, piece of candy. Please don't call me master. What's up, baby? Nice try. Hey! You get off the Rusaders! Only I'm allowed to beat up the Rusaders. Get out of here! Oh, I have a heavy attack in air. Ooh. Ooh. Piece of candy. Ooh. Uh, uh, uh. Look around a little bit. Look around a little bit. Is there anything that wants a bomb? Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. This looks interesting. What sort of place is Grand Sword? They do sound a little bit like Palicos, which is kind of weird. Careful. There they are. Goblin. Yeah! Boink! <laughs> <laughs> again! Again! Oh, wait. Have a goblin! Goblin attack! Go! Hey, oh, Sprout, welcome in. You're welcome to your Leah. You know, Leah's just shorter. Let's just say Leah. <laughs> I have a bad habit of reading out entire titles like an idiot, <laughs> like a little goober. Oh no, Goblin! Ow, guys. You pulled me out of my cutscene and immediately swung. That's cheating! Hold that! <laughs> yeah, Clark! Hold him! Man, we were really just like taking him down over there. Night Star Gazette! Wait, we already did it? We're done? That's it? We're at the capital? We win? GG gamers. Does this game have friendly fire? Not as far as I know. No. Okay, there's goblins down. Oh, why would you do that? Keep marching. Unless it's an explosion and your idiot pawns blow it up for no reason. No, as far as I know, it does not have friendly fire. It's over here. Oh, they're not kidding. That's like the whole canyon floor. We'll do this some other time. Uh, I don't think there's... Yeah, there's no friendly fire. 
Well, let me explain to you, Liam. The way this game works is very similar to most action combat games in which you have a heavy attack, you got your light attacks, your heavy attacks, you have special abilities like my little uh, shield uh, bop here. Um, you've got special abilities on your other weapons, which for me is my sword. Uh, if I was playing a strider, it would be a longbow and dual daggers. Uh, and for wizards, you just get a lot of different spells. And then there's a bunch of other classes and advanced classes and stuff like that, but you don't need to worry about that right now. Hey, you mind if I impale you? Thank you. Get him, Clark. Nice. Uh, you stop hitting that cow. Get him, Alicia. Welcome in, Archie. Stop doing that, or I will impale you. My cow! Hey! You leave that cow alone! Or I'll send you flying! Uppercut time, baby! Fuck! Okay, I'm on my way. Yeah! <laughs> Ooh, combo breaker. High elevations make fine watchtowers. Best we sight at threats at a distance. Good idea. Let's look around. Any threats? We are nearly there, men. Now march. Okay, I'm marching. Can you be a sword wielding wizard? Um, no, but you can uh cross class essentially. So, like for example, I could advance class and I'd become what Clark is with a two-handed big weapon. If you go from fighter to its advanced class, which is warrior, I think. Um, or I could cross class in wizard and become a magic knight, which yields, wields a tower shield and a hammer and a couple different spells. Get armed, master. Oh, a bandit. Hi. Any more bandits? That's rough, buddy. Anyway. Magic Knight sounds kind of awesome as fuck. Mm, not my aesthetic, really. I'm not a tower shield kind of person. And Warhammers are, eh, they're okay, I guess. I do like a good mace, but... What class are us uh, Rosaders? At the moment, you are a caster. I don't remember what the class name is exactly, but basically, you're a generalist. You have a couple elemental spells, a couple support spells, etc., etc., at your higher tier, if you stay in the caster tree, you eventually get like some ridiculously big splashy spells like summoning tornadoes and meteors and stuff like that, which look really good in this game. Or you can cross class into like rogue and become a magic archer. Or you can cross class into fighter and become a magic knight. That kind of stuff. No love for tower. Listen, I'm a kite shield kind of person if I'm tanking. An imposing structure up for it fell, I'm sure. Night, Ella. I thought those were arisen only. Oh, you might be right. Maybe only I can cross class. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, you're going to be a big old wizard no matter what. It's going all right, Sykes. How you feeling? A good start to any task is talking with others. Let's begin with that. I'm a little busy right now trying to escort a giant uh, Hydra head into the capital, but thank you for the advice, Rusaders. Ew, go to work. What if you just, I mean, here's an idea. Just don't. What are they going to do about it? They can't do anything. <laughs> I'm kidding. Thank you for the suit. Good luck at work. Between his duties as sovereign and the worm hunt. Do you get a thick beard? Uh, Not right now, no. You're very gender at the moment. No beard. I can't look at your face because for some reason the pawns are trying to stay uh, like in the camera line and facing away from me. Don't know what that's about. I quit. <laughs> Sorry guys, a VTuber told me I can't work anymore. Bye. Can we have a pointy hat? I will try my best to get you a pointy hat. How's that sound? We're just slow walking. 
I love to do the slow RP walk in video games. Do you have a cool cloak? Um, I don't know. What's in it for me? <laughs> We've arrived. Well done, men. Well done. A Hydra's head is a fine prize. His grace will be pleased with the core's work. Walk I mean, my work, not men. the core's work. We are heroes to the people of Grand Sorin. Relax a little bit. You can be proud of us. Mm. Gonna take some work for me to be proud of you. <laughs> Where's my loot? Oh, we get a free rest? Okay, now we're talking. I'll make for the castle directly to offer my report to his grace. I'll have words sent for you, friend. Pray, sojourn in the capital a while. Capital. <laughs> I love it. My best British accent. I don't fucking know. Uh, try and walk in. I am called Mason, if it please you. Sure, I guess. What's up, Mason? Oh, a little bow. Wow. Okay. Now we're talking. I guess you got quests. Her armor is unpractical. It's bothering me. Listen, it's. I mean, it's still. Unfortunately, it's fantasy. You're just gonna have to tolerate the fact that for some reason. Fantasy is obsessed with the idea of boob plates that would, like, slide arrows directly into your middle of your chest cavity. Um, sort of psycho, uh, psycho Magi. Uh, not, like, necessarily, but I I yes and no. Oh, hell yeah, Sleepy Saber. I guess. I mean, I'm sorry I dragged you into this horrid world. <laughs> I'm sorry I dragged you kicking and screaming into the Hollow Stars fan base. But hey, now that you're here, uh, try to enjoy yourself. And thank you for the delicious soup. I hope you're having a good time. It is not a chainmail bikini. That's true. We could have like 80s fantasy. Or was that 70s? I don't know. Or was that 60s? Fuck. When was that fantasy with like the chainmail bikinis and like the... um. Dudes running around in just a loincloth. What was that? What was that era of fantasy? Hmm. I can't remember. 80s? Yeah. Okay. Well, 70s? Okay, so 80s, probably. Fair enough. Fair enough. Hmm. I mean, listen, it's fashionable. I get it. Like, form-fitting armor looks very cool. It kind of defeats the purpose of armor in a lot of cases, but it looks cool, and I'm down for that. It's fantasy. Sometimes rule of cool wins. You know what else is a really bad idea? Swinging your sword in a giant wide arc in the hopes of uppercutting your opponent while moving your shield out of, like, a guarding position. But people still do it. So, I mean, welcome to fantasy. My word to you, begin with the pawns. Inquire about them here in Grand Sorin. Mm -hmm. Their kinds woven tight into the fate of their reason. If you know your destiny, know them. No, 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 no. See, this armor is perfectly suited to my type of fighting style. Uh, at least when I'm fighting... See, here's the thing. EXE. V15. A E X E rather. Sorry. Uh, my armor's impractical if I'm fighting a man. With weapons, yes. But there is no reason to wear full plate or chainmail in the desert while fighting giant monsters that could crush me like I'm like made of tin. It is better to have mobility than anything, and it breathes. I got these ventilation windows so I don't get overheated. That's how I rock. <laughs> now, if I'm fighting a human, I'll put on more armor, all right? Don't put it past me to slap on full plate. I will do it. I could confuse my enemies wearing bikini armor. That's true. I'll think about it. Why the jacket? It holds all my extra stuff. Potions, herbs, my emergency deployable arms, um, the internet Bible. Uh, you know, it's got all the stuff I really want in it. Sometimes, if I don't want to wear my boots, uh, it's got my boots of plus two ass kicking. I'm just kidding. I'm always wearing my boots, baby. Let's go. All right, I'll ask about the pawns. Thanks, bud. My emergency deployable arms. You heard me. I've gained quest knowledge. 
As far as I know, I did not steal it from any alchemists. No. No, I I, I got it from a, a friend. Depends on the situation, Peach Mango. Unlike in uh, video games, uh, I think that what I think video games have trained people to believe that like you specialize in one type of armor, or one type of armor is always best, right? Like, I think video games would have you believe, oh well, uh, clearly you would wear full plate and chainmail if you were strong enough to do it. You would always wear that, and I'm like, nah, dude, you wouldn't do that. Like, if you were traveling a lot, you'd probably be wearing like lighter like leathers at most, maybe like a chainmail like fucking shirt but even then like why not just wear padded gambeson or something like that you know something that's like a little lighter is it gonna weigh you down too much stuff like that if you were fighting something that's so big plate armor doesn't mean anything you wouldn't be wearing plate armor if you're fighting a human opponent plate armor is always going to be better than like agility you can pretend you're fast enough to dodge a sword or an arrow but i promise you you're probably not uh if you're actually in melee with an opponent like you don't want to trade hits and take that hit uh so really the right tools for the right job just like I wouldn't use Zephyr in every single fight. Like, yeah, Zephyr works for hunting monsters. And I love using Zephyr for hunting monsters. But uh, the right tool for the right job. Uh, <laughs> you don't have to do that, but thank you for the first super. Mm, it's good soup. They call him the Elysian. A name I hear far too often. Oh my gosh, the Elysian? The Asian? Such devastation. This is not what I had intended. <laughs> Do I have other named weapons like Zephyr? Maybe. That's a secret. <laughs> Do I use Zephyr to shave? No? No, that seems a little disrespectful to Zephyr. How very glib. Well, keep the man in mind. I have business with him myself. Uh, okay, do you have anything else to tell me? Seems you're at the center of the storm, Arisen. Or perhaps it's you that's spinning the rest of us about. Maybe. No, real talk. Do you have a question for me? Why do you keep having the question mark? No? Okay, well, fuck it, I guess. Uh, what do you sell, dude? Just herbs? A cloud of unease hangs over the land these days. I do have daggers, depending on when I need to use them. There's a misconception around daggers, too, that they're only good for an agile person. And here, you know, I'm going to tell you another secret. If you're strong and not bodybuilder strong, if you've got that lean muscle like I'm rocking, you're probably pretty agile. I know everybody thinks that, like, oh, a strength build is slow and ponderous. That's not true. Agility is directly tied to strength. The stronger you are, the faster you move. If you're not just, like, building muscle for aesthetics and you're building muscle for, like, use, you're probably pretty quick. Uh, and daggers are better suited to a strong opponent because daggers usually involve some form of wrestling or hand-to-hand -hand combat. It is rare that you will use daggers in a straight-up fight. If you have a dagger, you probably want to take your opponent to the ground or grapple them and stick it in between their plate. You want to put your dagger in a place where they're weak, like under shoulder pads or under the armpit or in the ribs or through an eye slit. Uh, so... Typically, daggers are not suited to the tiny little Kirito characters. They're suited to a bigger, stronger guy who's glad to go into, like, hand-to-hand -hand combat with you. If you want to have a, like, quick light weapon, I recommend spears. Now, spears typically are associated with, like, mooks, but spears are very good weapons. They keep you at a range. If you're fast enough, you can fight from a good distance and take advantage of that spacing, and they're easy to use. You don't have to really trade strength for strength. You just need to threaten your opponent and keep them away. I would say. Anyway, we've had this conversation. Uh, what if Zephyr had a detachable pommel? Zephyr does have a de detachable pommel, and I have ended them rightly. Don't test me. That's <laughs> where I keep my soup in that little thermos at the back of Zephyr. Zephyr's got an extendable ham uh, handle. I turn him into a halberd when I'm feeling like it. <laughs> Weapon shield tier list win? Mm, one day. One day. I'll think about it. How's that sound? Hey, what do you got for me? First time in the capital? Best find lodging first. I'm fine. I rested. So when can we go out to hunt actual monsters? You're gonna need a lot more training before you go to do that, rookie. What with folk coming in from all Grancis. Mm 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 mm. There's a fine place just inside the city gates. Just look for the sign. 
Spears are the go-to weapon for untrained villagers, but that doesn't mean that you can't be very skilled with a spear. A good spearman is pretty wild. I mean, and spears are just the best weapon. Like, here's the thing about spears. They are, they are skill equalizers in a lot of ways, much like bows, because uh, an important thing in melee combat is spacing. Spacing is super duper important. Like a mid-tier spearman is probably a match for a damn near expert swordsman. And a rookie spearman is probably a match for a relatively experienced swordsman. Assuming they don't like immediately get their spear grappled. You know what I mean? Because you don't need a lot of skill to be good with spears. And spears have one of the most important advantages possible in a melee fight, which is keeping people at a range. Spears are great. And if you're good with a spear, even better. Are you not giving me quests? I guess the quests are green, maybe. Maybe the yellow is just stuff to talk about. I have watched a little bit of Ruby, yeah. Spears are by far the most important weapon humanity has ever made. And that's cool. I mean, besides maybe firearms. Maybe. Hide rice? I'm not sure what that means. What do you mean by that? Hey! Uh, you might want to take a moment, back up, focus on something chill that has nothing to do with what's causing you panic, and take some deep breaths. You got this, gamer. Don't worry about it. I mean, that's not going to fix a panic attack, but you can do this. Spears W. Halberds? Yeah, halberds are badass. I love halberds. Uh, did somebody say Ruby? Maybe. What do I think of Flamberges? I think Claymores and Flamberges are undervalued weapons that are often, again, considered very slow, but I think they make very good weapons and are kind of, in their own right, an anti-spear weapon. They're also probably the best weapon you could have in a, like, outnumbered situation. Like, with a longsword, you know, you might be able to fight one or two, at most three opponents, I would assume, assuming you're better than them. You know, with a Claymore, you could threaten a lot of people. I think it's Montante style that's like that super whirling style where you spin a lot using your Claymore. It's one of the few times you actually want to be rotating frequently in combat, assuming you're being surrounded, because you can threaten a lot of space with a Claymore or a Flamberge. There's been a shipment of goods. The road is closed till it's been sorted. Have patience. It won't be long. Okay, dude. I don't know if I've ever watched Forge and Fire. Is that like that uh, blacksmithing show on YouTube? I think I've heard about it. Yeah, the buildings are pretty cool, I guess. I mean, honestly, this game looks really good for being coming out in what, 2013, 2012? Any opinion about katanas? I think katanas, katanas? Katanas are really, really good swords against an unarmored opponent. In the meth, in the in the spaces they were supposed to be used in, great weapons. Uh in some cases, not great weapons, and they will always lose to a good spearman or a longbow. Pointy stick would win, Jax. Thanks for the soup. <laughs> Who among you has seen the dragon? Who saw it raise a village at the southern shore? I did not. Hey, dude, why are you staring at this wall and giving it a quest? You, you seen the type unlike to judge a man by his mean alone. I'm gonna judge you. I'm judging you right now. I would ask you a favor, sir, if it please you. Sure. A wise choice. I warrant you'll be eager to hear what I have to say. I okay. have long searched for a certain toll. Uh-huh. Salomet's grimoire. Tis said its pages hold the power to grant the reader command of grand arcane magics. I don't know if I want to give that to you. The book itself <laughs> is in sorcery, you see. Even a novice is as a grand wizard with that grimoire in hand. Mm -hmm. I ask you to seek it out. And bring it to me, sir. Recompense? Pray, let us speak of such things once you have found the book. Wow, subtle, dude. You could just say you can't pay me. Dick. Uh, curved swords are best swords. Curved swords are the best cutting swords. Uh, in certain situations, they're pretty bad. I would not bring a curved sword to fight a man in chainmail, for example. Uh, <laughs> curved swords are very, very good uh, in a lot, a lot of situations and are genuinely good swords. Uh... What's that one sword that has a slight curve at the tip of it and is kind of a heavier sword with a good point as well? I'm trying to remember the name of it. It's like, uh, it's got a guard that slides out in front of your hands. You know what I mean? As far as blunt weapons, they're very cool. They're very good. They take less skill than a sword, and that's not an insult. That's a good thing. Uh, you don't have to worry about edge alignment. They crush armor. Uh, they'll hurt somebody really bad, even if they're wearing chainmail and stuff like that. I think blunt weapons are undervalued and very awesome. 
I've never watched any Common Rider, but I would like to. Not a falchion. The word I'm thinking of is different. It's not a falchion. It's a sort of longer sword that has a curve at the end of it. It's, it's like a falchion, but longer. I'm trying to remember the name of it. Fuck. Hmm. Not a cutlass. A messer. Messer. Thank you. Mazer? Messer? Yeah, you're right, houseplant. That's what I was thinking of. Mmm, soap. I'll wash my mouth out with that. <laughs> yeah, gun was definitely the sword I was thinking of in that case. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're right, though. Wait a minute. Can I get up here? Yeah. Okay. Fine. <laughs> then I won't. That's such a German knife? Is it? Das Messer. I'm learning! Get those rats. Pest control, baby! I'll take that. I'll take that. Okay, Rosader. Oh, that's right. We can parkour all over this town. Shortcut. Hey, what's this? This is open on the roof for some reason. What's going on up here, gamers? Ooh! Piece of can? Oh, never mind. I don't have any strong opinions about modern combat knives. Keep in mind, a lot of these weapons I haven't had a chance to use myself. Like, I've never touched a messer. I like them. I think they're cool. Uh, and, like, I understand the idea behind them, but take what I say with a grain of salt. I've never wielded uh, a messer. 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 Thank you for the delicious Super Chat Bunny Hugger. Yum. Listen, I love stealing precious family heirlooms. We catch those. First try. You guys coming or are you going to follow your demise? Mmm, balmy incense. So balmy. Nah! That pawn almost screwed me. That was scary. You almost killed me, Alicia. Messer. So it is Messer. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. The more you know. Ooh, piece of chest. Let's go. Third journal entry. Hmm. That is very weird, Gale. I've always thought of glaives as bladed spears. Have I ever practiced Hema? No, but I very much want to. Uh, the closest I've gotten is, uh, you know, a couple sparring matches with some friends, uh, the occasional monster hunt, and, um, Amped Guard, which is like LARPing if you were allowed to tackle and shield, bla shield bash and drop kick people. Basically LARPing if you were allowed to be as violent as, uh, I want to be. <laughs> I'll heal your wounds. Arnis? I don't know what that is, no. Nice battle kill, bro. I have no, I have no idea what I'm doing out here, but I'm looking around. Messer? Well, I hardly know her. Fair. That's fair, Captain Obvious. Ooh, there's a sign here. What does it say? What does it say? The black cat deals in rare goods. Ooh. Oh, I see. Interesting. You've good eyes. Clear. Truth be told, most folk I see are too glass-eyed to tell an authentic piece from a crude... Mm. Wait, what happened? Sorry, it's a Filipino martial style. Did I miss something? What are we talking about? Uh, That's beautiful. Armist stand for something? I believe it's Latin for weaponry. Hence the phrase, take up arms. It's probably where the word arms came from or originated in English. It probably came from armies. Arnis is the one with the dual wielding stick blades. Huh. Interesting. Oh, that's the Filipino fighting style. I see. Arnis. Arnis. Oh, okay, okay, okay. 
Do I like LARPing? Good question. Here, let's take a small moment aside from this and talk about uh, LARPing for a second. I like the idea of LARPing more than I like LARPing. Um, I like Amped Guard because it... Okay, here's the thing. LARPing is better for inclusivity and being approachable. I think LARP is very fun. And if you want to LARP, you should LARP. I think that's a lot of fun. Um... Typically, it's a little rules heavy for me, as in you're not allowed to do headshots, you can't do thrust toward the face, uh, you can't hit too, too hard, uh, you're not allowed to, like, kick or kick shields, you're not allowed to take someone to the ground. Um, basically, it's protective, and it should be, because it is just for fun. Uh, aside from that, there's, like, a lot of, like, magical classes and wizards, so somebody could be like, I cast stop, and then you just kind of stand there, and that's fine, and that can be fun in its own right. But I like Amped Guard because I'm allowed to get violent with people. I'm allowed to, like, you know, kick their shields away or, like, tackle them if they, you know, drop their guard too hard. Um, stuff like that. Like, when I was doing Amped Guard, the guy who was training me ended up, I mean, legitimately, like, tackling me multiple times or just shoving me to the ground or picking me up under my knees and dropping me. And, I mean, that's cool as fuck. I'm down for that. Like, I want to be in hand-to-hand -hand combat with somebody and test my, test my might. You know what I mean? Um, that's actually where I first got hit by a Warhammer, which it was just a LARP weapon. So it wasn't like permanently damaging me or anything. Uh, but it was a big, big foam hammer. And I mean, the head of this hammer was as big as my torso. Like this was a big hammer. So despite being made of foam, it hit hard. At the time I was pretty small. I hadn't, uh, I hadn't got as big as I am now. And I was wielding a shield and a sword and it hit me in the shield. And I'm not kidding. It was like fucking anime kickback. Like, I grounded myself, spread my legs, and it still slid me backwards. And then he hit me in my legs. My right leg collided with my left leg. Both legs went directly to hip height. My head also went to hip height. And like a cartoon, I, like, boarded in air for a moment before my shoulder and my face hit the ground. Because he had hit me so hard, it swept both of my legs out from under me and turned me horizontal. He rotated me with a warhammer. It was wild. Fun time. Really fun. But it hurt like hell. I got a lot of bruises doing amp guard, but it was fun. The get rotated. <laughs> Core memory. <laughs> anyway, I like amp guard. I would do LARP, but it definitely feels like I would be very uh, hampered in my ability to truly like engage somebody in combat. Like, I don't know. I feel I feel like not being able to swing for the head is a big one for me. I get it. You don't want to hurt somebody, but these are foam weapons. I mean, a little donk on the head ain't gonna hurt you that bad. And the head's a very vulnerable spot. It's easy to swing for, especially when you're in, like, sword-to-sword -sword combat. I feel like that's such a major target and such, like, an off-center point for a blade that it is often one of the first things you do want to hit. It's either the wrists or the head a lot of the time, you know? Yeah, it could always cause permanent injury, but I, as far as I'm concerned, it's like, okay, so what? We're just not going to tackle and fucking... American football anymore or whatever. Like, yeah, MMA fighters could permanently damage each other. So what? If I want to get hit with a sword, I want to get hit with a fucking sword. <laughs> if I sign that waiver, sign, fucking donk my skull, baby. Goosh that brain juice around. I don't give a shit. <laughs> There's no challenge. Selling my, uh, <laughs> wares to you, though. I'm sure you'll find all you need. Hmm, let's see what you got, bud. Mmm, fairy stone. I don't know what that does. Oh, you have tools. I don't know what to do with the tools. Uh, tool for farmers, tool for farmers. Crops, carpenter. Are these just for fun? Oh, well, that's expensive. Still, one couldn't hurt. Oh, he doesn't have any. Oh, I'm over encumbered. Oh, I see. Hmm. <laughs> You're right, Siffy. I am the type to think about that. And I could take most animals in a fist fight. Whoa! Are these like late game weapons? That's cool. Whoa! A little teaser for some of the weapons we can get later. All right! Love that. All right, let's not spoil all of them, though. Whoa! Eh. Eh. Not my favorite. 
Oh, put the visor down. Can I put the visor down? Boo! Oh, a jester's cap. <laughs> I'm sure you'll find all you need. No, I have not actually fought a bear. Uh, holy heck, Rin Bear sort of stuff is more my thing because I probably would not be able to get uh, handle getting rotated by a Warhammer. Understandable, Bunny Hugger. It is not for everybody. Again, I do think LARP's a ton of fun. If you want to play with like a, a, a not, I'm not saying this in a derogatory way. Genuinely, if it's not your thing, that's totally cool. Most people don't want to get hurt. I don't want to get hurt, but I do want to test myself in my ability to get hurt and put that on the table. That danger is what makes me fight like a dog. That's what's going to make me really, truly test myself. Um, but I don't think most people are going to want to do that. And there's nothing wrong with just playing with, you know, LARP rules or whatever. And like trying to keep yourself from actually wounding yourself. You don't want, you, I mean, nobody wants to be the guy who has to tell the story when someone's like, Oh, how'd you break your arm? You're like, <laughs> I was swinging a sword around and it was silly. And I was being dumb. Like, you don't want to go into work the next day. And someone's like, how'd you get that scar? Did you get in a cool fight? And you're like, no, <laughs> not really. You got that dogma in him. Honestly, politics-heavy, plot schemey LARP sounds super fun. I really like social deduction type games, um, and uh, I like trying to like I like sussing out lies. I like to think I have a pretty good ability to read people like fucking books. So uh, those politics-heavy like media and games, a lot of fun. Things like Werewolf and stuff like that, or uh, what's the other one that was uh, um, Amogus to a degree. I would do political LARPs. I've never had the chance to do it. One LARP I want to uh, go to at some point is Bikaline, Um, Because that seems like it's really, like, really, really in character. And that's a ton of fun. I would definitely do that. You know, I've never had a chance to play Town of Salem, but I want to. Among Us with the Rosaders? Maybe one day, yeah. I could see that being, like, a membership thing. I've never played Tactics Ogre, nah. Among Us with the Hollow Boys win? Tomorrow. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, not tomorrow. Tomorrow is uh, my interview with Haka. And then the day after that, I believe we're doing Dead by Daylight. So, hey, welcome into the Resaders, Jose. Juarez. That's such a fucking cool name, actually. That rolls well. That sounds good. Anyway, uh, woo, I'd like to see you and Axel go head to head to head in something like Werewolves. Is Axel really good at social deduction games? <laughs> That'd be fun. Yeah, I'd give it a shot. I'd try most meat as long as it's not an endangered animal. I want to try every meat if I can help it. Night, Yuniji. Hope you feel better. No, He's so good, it's kind of scary. Oh, good. Yeah, that'd be a lot of fun then. I would enjoy that, I think. That's right. I need to sell things. Okay, let's go sell some junk. We are over encumbered. I cannot pick up this large nut. Silence. Yeah, yeah, accept all, accept all. I'm not going to read these. I don't care. They're just do things. And I'm fine with that. I will just do things. Hey, bud, you got to do you sell junk? truly man. Is a marvelous creature. Even in these dire times, desires abound. Where desperation might take hold, dreams instead arise. Ah, I see. Axel's good at reading people. That makes sense. As long as man yet dreams, this world will manage well enough. Mark my words. That makes folk in the trade of making dreams turn true the saviors of the world, eh? Folks like you and me. Tis work well worth doing. I don't know what that is, Axe Priest, but if it's eternal, I don't want it. That sounds like cheating to me. <laughs> Welcome to R. Smith's Ale House. Thanks, dude. Uh, do any of you sell anything or buy things so I can sell to you? That could be pretty cool. Are you healing that NPC right now? My guy. Oh, no, you're healing. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, what about here? This looks like a door I can go in. It is not. All right, let's look at the map. We got to find a shopkeeper. Hold on a second. There's a notice board behind me. I already went there. Apothecary. Perfect. An apothecary will work. Let's go to the apothecary and sell. Hey, oh, friend. I have loot for you. We don't deal in the like of Brimoise here. Okay. We're in honest business. 
Those magic tomes are oft forgeries. Uh -oh. They're stolen property. Huh. Boy, there's a notion. Why not ask a thief? Okay. You're more like to have it than honest folk like me, I'll warrant you. You Take sound really judgmental. Anyway, you want to buy some stuff from me? Take all the time you like. I got too many small nuts. You can have five of those. Enjoy. What else can I give you? Uh, How much does this weigh? Does it say? It doesn't say. That's annoying. Oh, wait. Yes, it does. So is that the total weight or is it 0 0.10 per green warish that I'm holding? That's a good question. Let me think. Mm, still, I'll give you like five of those. Well, that might be used to make healing potions. Maybe not. Mm, per? All right. I'm giving you five of those. Uh, there's some gear I don't want that I'm holding on to too so I'll sell some of the gear because that's probably where most of my carry weight's going to come from you can have all of my moldy food literally all of it it's all yours congratulations enjoy that moldy food I know you're going to love it I know you're going to love it does food have an expiration date? I guess it does does the food in my inventory go bad? that'd be kind of funny actually I'm down for that ooh that shit's kind of heavy let's give you some of those you can have one of these. Festival pie, kindling, empty flask. I've got four of those. Airtight flask. Da, 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 da. Do I need this airtight flask for anything? Oh, so food does go bad. And you can put it in this airtight flask to keep it from going bad. I will hold on to that. Oh, cloud wine. Yeah, I'll hold on to most of this stuff. I think it's just materials for crafting. I gotta figure out where I can craft. Hey, don't need that. Oh shit, I got a lot of stuff I'm not using anymore. You can take that, you can take that, you can take that, you can take that. Wait, I probably can't get these ever again. Not that. Maybe we'll put our gear away. Yeah, we'll put our gear away because I, I I am loath to sell gear in RPGs. I like to hold on to it just to look at it. Um, is this the bank? Oh. Oh, okay. I can manage my stored items here. Hey, bud. I'm the one. Fuck you very much. Forgive me. I spoke poorly. I simply imagined the sort of figure pulled right from legend. <laughs> yeah, well, I didn't expect a douchebag to insult me as soon as I walked into an inn. I figured somebody a little more welcoming would be here, but hey, but we're all disappointed, aren't we? I am Asala, and this is my inn. Though we deal in a number of trades here, I hope this is the first of many visits, sir. I am at your service. Thank you. Oh, you wish to learn of the pond legion? No. Then the shortest path to the answers you seek leads west from here. There you'll find Grand Soren's Pawn Guild. It is a gathering place for their kind. Okay. Just tell the sentries you have business with the guild. They'll let you past. Have your pick. Any you like. Will it Did I grab the DLC gear yet? Nope. Didn't even know there was DLC gear. That frees up a lot of my carry weight, but I'm still carrying a good amount of junk I don't really want to carry necessarily. Uh, anything I want to drop off? Ah. What do you got for me, gamer? What's your DLC gear? The Lift Stone. A stone that may spirit the user back to the entrance. Nope. The Eternal Fairy Stone. Huh. Nope. What is all this? Why do you have all this in here? Weird. Ah, the DLC gear. The Tiara of Enlightenment. The Ruminator's Monocule. The Jester's Cat. Whoa! There's a lot of shit in here. How strong is this garbage? Is this, like, insanely overpowered? Because I'm just not going to wear it if that's... Hey, I have a... What's, what's your face's armor? The lady I was guiding. DLC gear is OP. No. Then I don't want it. Ooh, that's cool looking, though. Damn. Yeah, I'm good without it. Have your pick. Any you like. Or will it be Ooh, change vocation, please. Okay, apparently I can already upgrade. 
So we could go Strider, which is daggers and bows. That is uh, the baseline class for the higher tier, which is, I believe, Ranger is the higher tier of that. Yep, longbows. Um, and then we can go Warrior, which is the higher tier of what I am now. And then we can go Sorcerer. So now we know that you right now, Rosaders, are Mage. One day you will be Sorcerer. Uh, and that day is today. Well, then I won't have any heals. Maybe it's tomorrow. Um, but I could go a combo class, which is Arisen only. So Mystic Knight, for example, uses Sword and Mace. And Staves, apparently. So I can use Staves, Swords, Maces, and Magic Shields, which are like these big tower shields. Um, Assassin, which is a combo between... Um, Fighter and Strider. So you use uh, shields, bows, swords, and daggers. It's actually pretty interesting because the shields are small shields. You could strap them into your arm. So you could fight using dual daggers and a shield. Or you fight with one sword and a shield. Or you fight with one sword and a longbow. So basically it's shield or bow, sword or daggers. Which is pretty cool. This ignites are counter and parry kings. Hmm. Interesting. And then there's Magic Archer, which is the combo between Strider and uh, Mage. They use daggers and staves or magic bows. And by that, I mean they basically only use their magic bows because the magic bow is very strong. Magic Archer is a very strong class. Mystic Knight block is OP. Oh, Warrior for the big bonks. I could go Warrior. However, here's the thing. A, Warriors have very, very, very low weapon variety, which always bothers the shit out of me in games. Uh, B, they struggle like hell against flying opponents, which is annoying. Magic Archer? Yeah, that's interesting. You don't see enough games with Magic Archers, honestly. Why did the music in this town just not happen? What's up with that? That's true, but then I have to let my pawns do all the work. Blah. You do have a party dealt with the flying opponents. Yeah, that's true, I guess. Hmm. Music don't go. Yeah, where'd you go, music? Their master works all. You can't go wrong. Hmm. They do shoot magic with their arrows. And by that, I mean they don't even shoot real arrows. They shoot magical arrows. I don't know what Arc of Obliteration is. Isn't that that move where they charge for like an hour and then swing? There's a reason I don't play Great Swords in Monster Hunter. <laughs> uh, I could try Warrior since I haven't really. And then if we get bored of it, we could swap off of it. Honestly, no big deal. Which class is best at eating pawns? Probably the warrior. Probably the warrior. I do love climbing on monsters, and that is the assassin's specialty. Very cool. But, but, let's start with warrior and see how we feel. If we get bored, is there any axes in this game at all? I think it's all maces and swords, right? Like, I don't think there's a single axe in this game, if I remember correctly. Hmm... Because game devs want to find a way to differentiate two-handed weapons from one-hand weapons, even though it's incredibly unrealistic, John Doe. Swords and hammers? That's such a bummer. Damn. Damn. Swords and hammers, huh? That might influence my decision a little bit here, gamers. I might go Assassin or Mystic Knight. Ooh, Assassin or Mystic Knight. Hmm. Hmm. We'll start with Warrior. We'll see how we feel. Oh. oh. I guess I gotta go buy a Warrior weapon. I'll be back. Oh, God! Ah! Help, I'm naked! Nice fit, though. Hey, an armory. Perfect! Good weapons are need no different than food or shelter. 
Masterworks Morning, Plo. Masterworks all, you can't go wrong. Says you, dude. I thought I put away one of these two-handed weapons. Did I not? Yeah, didn't I have judgment? Oh, getting rid of shields as soon as I finally get a metal shield. That's a bummer. Oh, well. Ooh, interesting. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not the horned helm. Hmm. I have judgment in the sword. Okay, let's go equip what we can. How about that? Why am I? Well, it's because I forgot to have my armor on. We are. We can. It is a prayer. Have your pick. Any you like. What will it be today? Oh, good. I can still wear these. Wait, do I not have a two-handed sword? Did I sell it? Somebody else have it? Oh, you're holding it. Hey, give me that, Clark. What will it be? Have your pick. Come again. Bye, dude. Oh, wait. Give me some skills. Have your pick. What will it be today? I don't have any skills yet with a warrior, so we need to learn some. Cover them up! Mm-hmm. Agreed. Agreed. All right, so let's see. Is there anything that would increase... Great loot just damage sustain... Nah. Is there anything that would increase my stamina? No. Withdraws the blade with a sweep after stabbing the target. Extends a chain of one-handed ones. Blah, blah. Uh, pommel strike. Stab foes and fiercely slash upward. Oh, no. Lunges in the air. Lunges in while driving the hilt of the blade to the target. The limited range, it easily stuns. Oh... I do like that. Yes. Oh. Okay, so this is a charge attack. Got it. And this is going to be my pommel strike. And this will be... This will be my upward strike. And then I also would like to learn skills for a Rusader. Yay! Time to learn more fire. Frazil. Ice damage? We like ice damage. Bleering. Magical aura on these are the blinds. Foes who enter. Invoke some magical center to clear his foes. Oh, yes. We love clearing poison. Thank you, Hajime, for the happy holidays. I love being your favorite blastard. How dare you use your evil Octavio statements against me. I want the Thunder Boon. That sounds cool as hell. Dark Boon, Holy Boon, Fire Boon, blah, 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 blah. Why don't you learn some ice skills? And levitate. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh. Cool. Let's change our skills, shall we? You know, high angle. And now you know, Frazil. And. That's it on that side. You're also going to learn Thunderboon and Halidom. Wow, you just got way stronger. Good job. We're proud of you. Woohoo! All right, let's test out our new abilities real quick so we don't forget them. Uh, so we got... Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Walk away. Walk away or else. You're not going to like this. Move. Move or else. Okay. That's my upward strike, and this is my pommel strike. All right, now we know. Let's go, baby. Typically, two-handed maces are like my last pick in RPGs. I'm down to give it a shot. Let's try it out. I'm supposed to head to the west. Now that we know where we're going, let's go ahead and get our asses over there. We've got to go whist over here, I guess. While I get in... Oh, okay, I see the path. Here we go. Is it a slow weapon? Probably. I did upgrade my uh, chain of attacks, so I should strike a little faster with my full chain. Oh my god, is that my heavy? I think that's my heavy. Maybe it's not. Oh my god, this is just slow. Ooh. 
Well, it is what it is. Let's do this. State your business. Yes. Pawn Guild, is it? It is. All right. Through here and to the left. Just don't make a nuisance of yourself, I. Dude, you're a nuisance. Your existence is a nuisance to me. How dare you? Don't make a nuisance of yourself. Yeah, how's that, dick? <laughs> the pawn guild stands ahead. Got him! I'm proud of you for not giving up at spelling pick. You, you got it, Lucille. You're very strong now. <laughs> you persevered in the in the face of adversity. And I can respect that. Hey, what's up, dude? Oh, no! We're taking a little nap. It's rough when you gotta take a little nap on the stone floor, but I bet it's warm in here, so I get it. Merciful maker. Please. Please, no. What's wrong, bud? Sir, I... I know it is not a matter fit to thrust upon a passing stranger, but... Please. I ask only that you listen a while. Okay. Thank you, sir. This child is... He's my son. Oh. Was my son. Oh. His heart stopped not a few hours past. Mine stopped every time I lay down. You're fine. He was weak, his sweetheart, since he was but a babe. Oh. I had long known he would not live long. That's rough, bud. But to see it, to watch him slip from my grasp, I am left with naught but rage at my impotence. Fain to try any means that I might to bring him back, I look to magic. Uh oh. Uh oh! Anything to bring him back to me. I know it for madness, but still I. Here. Pray. Accept thee, sir. The first of those stones I bought from a merchant my son and I passed in our travels. He spoke of a powerful magic within it. Gather rocks such as this together, he said, and even the dead shall wake. Uh oh! I want to blindly believe in such tales, my. Still, I thought there whoa, 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 there's nothing wrong with a little bit of necromancy. Necromancers are just clerics who got there a little late. They're still getting you back on your feet, aren't they? <laughs> so I searched, but by the time I found a second, the whole pursuit rang hollow. Damn, that's rough, bud. It is a vain hope to seek immortality in such trinkets, I know. I felt a fool for Damn, that would be really good writing if there wasn't the ability to resurrect in this game. But, uh, here we are. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, got it. Thanks, bud. See you later. Sorry about your kid or whatever. Necromancers just want to raise a family. Exactly. And that's beautiful. I like how I still just took that. Like, I know what it is. I know it could save his kid. And I'm like, thanks, dude. See ya. Hmm, these doors are closed. All right, where's the pawns guild? That looks like a pawns guild, right? Or is that a way out of the city? That might be a way out of the city. We might have gone too far. We went too far. Ignore that. We got to go this way. Yeah. That's a big building. Maybe it's that. Aha! Hello! Roll. Nice. What's up, dude? Sorry about that. <laughs> I like your stagger. Welcome, Arisen. We have awaited your coming. If you say so, Barnaby. This pawn is called Barnaby. Ah. Oh. I tend to the affairs of the pawn guild. That's weird pawn duty. Aren't you supposed to be, like, fighting or whatever? Uh, I... Good question, Jax. Uh, thank you for the delicious soup. And the answer is no. Necromancy is not inherently evil. Uh, I think it is. A, I think. Hmm. How do I explain this in a way that is tactful? I think that assuming. Hmm. Here. Okay, so you know what? Let me get back to this topic in a second. I want to get some more music. I'm tired of standing around with no music. Rest for pawns. And as Let me finish this conversation. Pawns. I'll talk to you about it in just a second. The Everfall lies beneath Grand Sorin. It is a place of great importance to our kind. Sure, dude. For now, let us rejoice in the coming of the Arisen, the light that guides the Legion. Cool. 
I'm rejoiced. Now, give me my quest. Me to burden you, weary from the road as you must be, but I fear trouble brews. I would beg your assistance in this matter, Arisen. You have my thanks. Okay. Tell me your dark tale. Okay. You got a cool lock gate, got it? Lies the Everfall, an ancient place that sleeps beneath Grand Soren's stones. Ah. We pawns have long served as keepers of the entrance to this place. Got it. Since the dragon's coming, a strange aura has filled the Everfall. A presence. If it be some oh. omen of evil to come, we cannot allow it to go unchecked. I mean, you I could, but... Seek out the cause of the change, or some proof of what's happened. The Everfall is a place unique unto itself. This is not a simple task, nor a favor I ask lightly, which is why I ask you, Arisen. Please, lend us your aid. Sure. Fuck it. I'm going in. Um, so, now, necromancy. Let's see if there's music down here, first of all. Did this game just stop having music suddenly? Is that what we're dealing with now? Is there just no more music? Did I break something? I guess there's eerie cave music. Okay, here we go. Nice. Music. So. Oh, spooky. Spooky. We got spooky bats running around. Uh-oh. I see why they call it the Everfall. You think I can make it down there? Rosader? Go check it out for me. <laughs> oh, I'm kidding. Okay, so as far as necromancy goes, let's talk about that for a second. I think that necromancy in and of itself, as a practice, is not evil. However, I think that it depends, in a lot of cases, how the necromancy works. If it's bringing back, like, souls and tying them to a rotting body, that's a little fucked up. If it's essentially just flesh fleshomancy and you can just manipulate, like, dead bones or corpses to do your will, ain't nothing wrong with that. It's no different than, like, eating something. Like, who cares if you bring it back? Why is that a problem? Why does that matter? Who, who's mad about that? Like, yeah, you should probably ask permission, depending on the body. Like, you don't want to raise someone's grandma in front of them or something. That could probably be pretty traumatizing. But if it's, like, a long-dead warrior or some old skeleton in a graveyard that nobody tends to anymore, I mean, who are you hurting? Or an animal, preferably. You just raise an animal. Like, why would I want a zombie man if I could have a zombie bear? You know what I mean? Meh. I hear something. None would believe Grand Soren held such a place beneath it. Oh, I'd believe it. Clark. A bandit that tried to mug you. Yeah, you know, stuff like that. Oh, you big old spoiters. What are you doing? You big stinkers. Another one. Doing God's work, killing giant, harmless spiders that did nothing to me. Why oh, you guys make so much noise? Stop making so much noise. Yeah, I've got more than enough. Silence, peasant. You need not worry about curatives where we're going. Bum, 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 bum. The method is not evil, but the circumstances can make it undesirable. Yes, yes, exactly. Well, if I put Clark in the pit, I'm going down here with less people, and that's probably a bad idea. What's this? Whoa, you guys actually killed that bat? You can do that. Huh. The more you know. No, I'm not raising any zombies. I do not under I, I, I do not do the necromancy. That is not a skill I possess. Yet. Ooh, delicious green wattish. I am thankful. Any enemies besides bats? Dodge that, Dick. Are you guys gonna fight back against the bats or just let them keep chewing on you? Because it seems like you're just letting them chew on you.
Well, I mean, sticking a dragon on a whole kingdom does seem like a little fucked up, but, you know, teach their own. Damn, you guys are tanky. Take that, baby. Combo. 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 Uh oh, ooh, we got a little lightning blade. Demon Fang. Ba 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 da ba ba da ba da ba. Hey, get off him! Stop that! <laughs> That's kind of funny, yeah? There we go. Easy as that. See, that's why the dual daggers are pretty cool. Let's see going nuts out there. Hmm. Hmm. Not a bad point. Not a bad point. About the whole, like, uh, disruptive innovation thing. But I will say that, like, push comes to shove. I would much rather somebody, like sets aside their, like, qualms about using a corpse and saves my life than somebody be like, actually, it would be immoral of me to, to raise this body and protect you with it because they, they, uh, you know, still have the right of being a body. I'm like, dude, I would eat this motherfucker if we were on an abandoned island, so I have no shame about using their corpse as a weapon if I have to. Oh, yeah, you're right, my lamp. Good point. Did somebody just jump off? Okay. Mm-mm. -hmm. There's a lever controls this door, master. Man, fuck the no-kill rule. Batman, get out of here with that. Hello? Is there anybody in this little dark womb? Steady now. I hear the undead. There, oh, this skeletons? Aha! Behold my wrath! You like maces? Wait, did you guys get back up? Hey! Sit down! Okay, get in there, chop, chop, chop. That's all. We have triumphed. Oh, hello, friend. Wait, wait, wait. I'm looting. Don't hit me. Thank you. Thank you for waiting. Thank you. Watch that bomb barrel. Don't you throw that at me. Clark! Clark. Hey, there's spicy mushroom tea down here? That's delicious. Maces and hammers are feel-good weapons for you? I don't know. I'm a big sucker for, like, uh, hand-and-a-half swords, spears, axes, uh, even daggers. Uh, I like a good longbow once in a while, but maces just never really been my thing. I keep trying. I, I want to like them, but just not quite there. This place hides something. Shall we take a look? Ooh, a lever. Oh. I just closed something. Uh-oh. This is a lot of loot. Just laying here. I'm down. Hey, 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 hey! No! Fuck! I cannot Strength in numbers, arisen. We have triumph. Cool. Well, that was. Oh, that's rough, buddy. Let me get you up here. Wrong lever! Gone. Maces are... Oh, I see. Pole arms, my one true love. Yeah, pole arms are pretty cool. I like pole arms, all right. I'm a sucker for pole arms. Hey, come over here, zombies. Come here. Come here, guys. Wah! I missed everybody. Boo! Help me! Shut up, you. Everything's under 
control! Bing! <laughs> Ugh. Oh, wait, he doesn't like the healing, I don't think. I think the healing's damaging him. Yes! Life bringing magic! It kills them! I'm working on it again. Oh, I'm over encumbered. I can't pick up any more. You know, for being like the strong class, I can't really carry a lot, which is kind of annoying. There we go. What's the difference between a polearm and a spear? Not much. They're both pole arms at the end of the day. Sides and sickles. I find them inefficient, but they're very cool. Can you please get out of the way? I'm trying to hit your buddy. Thank you. Clark, you're not who I wanted. That's who I wanted. Giddy ass. Yeah. All right, pick up all this loot. I demand it. Pick up the loot. Claymore explosives. <laughs> Fair. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, dual wielding sickles to climb. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. Good night, Helia. All right, let's give some of our equipment over to others. You're right. It's time to drop off some of my curatives and junk like that with uh, you, Resators, because I'm tired of holding on to all of it. Uh, and it's eating up so much of my inventory space. So, rabbit pelts. We're going to give all that to the Resator. Ba -ba -ba. Most of my crafting junk, I guess I'm going to hand over just because I don't want to carry all of it. It's a pretty stone. You get to hold a pretty stone. Oh, Kassardite's kind of heavy. This hunk of ore is probably pretty heavy. It's not, actually. Weird. I thought that was going to be way heavier. Saurian Tail's kind of heavy, though. Wolf Pelt? Mmm, sure. You guys are okay carrying all my garbage, right? I know you are. <laughs> what am I carrying that's so fucking heavy? Is it mostly my gear? Or is it mostly our healing? Oh, it might be our healing items. Oh, mushrooms. Mushroom! Okay, I guess that's fine for now. I need to figure out how to combine stuff later so we can actually, like, get out of here. Or, you know, put away this stuff. Etc, etc. I hear something. I hear something in the distance. Uh-oh. Let's not deal with that just yet. Yeah, make some moonshine. You won't. Okay. Thank you. Mushroom fruit smoothies. I have never heard of that. I do like a good uh, strawberry banana smoothie, though. Or kiwi banana smoothie. Woo! Never heard of mushroom fruit smoothies, though. That sounds kind of good. What, does it got like an earthy taste to it or something? I love mushrooms on meat. Mushrooms on meat? That goes hard. Mushrooms on smoothie? Never really considered it. Hey, guys. Oh, walking bones. Fuck! Hey! Stop that! You dick! Wait, is there a wizard down there? What the hell's happening? There is! You monster! Uh oh, fuck! There we go! Hey, hey, why didn't you get Alicia? What the hell? 
Oh, portobello steak. Woo. Delicious. Oh, let's all get in this tomb for a second, shall we? Oh, man. That'd be so good. I think rice is a mushroom. Huh. Mushroom steak with mashed potatoes and oh, some steamed asparagus. Just a little bit of salt. Uh, you're making me hungry. Quit it. Someone's out there really munching. You hear that? Is that one of you, Rosaders? Is that one of you, Rosaders, having a delicious mushroom steak with like sauteed mushrooms? Oh, with some of that delicious onion juice. Ah, oh, mushroom and onion saute. Oh, okay. I thought something bad was happening. It's just a bunch of zombies. We're good. Charge me up. Give me the lightning. Let's do it! Bonk! Damn, these guys are really durable, huh? Durable this! Get off, Clark! Hey! Oh, we gotta move a little bit. Eating an orange, dude, that sounds delicious. Guess we'll have to make do with another fa with our fancy dinner of pizza rolls. I'm all out of pizza rolls. Aww. Oh, they don't like fire. That's good. Hi, guys. Huh. Come here, get him. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Kill him! Nice! You love to see it. What do we got in here? A verdant hood. Is that a new hat for you, Rosader? So you can look like a little goober? I, are you guys gonna look like little goobers now? It is. It's a hat for the Rosaders. Aww. Aww. <laughs> I love your little hunch. Take that. Yes, you will. This looks interesting. I don't know if I've ever tried roasted asparagus, but I have enjoyed quite a bit of a steamed asparagus, and I do like that a lot. I like steamed veggies a ton. Huh. You guys want to fight him, or what are we feeling about that? I guess we should fight him, but that's a, that's a pretty scary opponent. Let's real quick uh, heal up with some of our curatives. Um... I'm gonna use some of my nuts. What? Yeah, I want Clark to use it. Clark, heal yourself. What? Okay, fine. Do you guys just not heal yourselves? Fuck's sake. All right, let's get in here. Fuck it. Hey. Hi. Ooh, good music cue. Let's go. What? What are you doing? Why? Whoa, 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 why are you being weird? Whoa, why are you being weird? Yeah, stagger him. Oh, I'm focusing. Uh oh. Hey, 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 hey! Back here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, somebody's down. Hold on a second. I gotta dodge a bit because he looks like he wants a piece of me. Yeah. Ah! Oh, all right. Excuse me! Ah! Ow, dude! That hurt! Get up. Oh, he angry, angry. Oh, yeah, he's doing a little dance. Do your little dance. You won't. Yeah! Come on! Get up. Ah! 
The sight of women excites it. What does that mean? What do you mean by that? Hey, Alicia, you might want to keep your distance and use your bow for this one, champ. Oh, my God. This motherfucker just dropped a WWE move on Clark. Wild. Bonk. Get him. Get up, I said. Why are you hiding, coward? Get up! Yeah! Come on! Yeah! Oh. Huh. I'm not done with you! <laughs> hey, get out of here! There we go. I'll beat this face. Silly little bats. Stop it. Quit it. Quit it. Okay. Hmm. There are many side paths here, but I really want to go beat the brakes off that troll. Where'd he go? Went down there somewhere. I think. Oh well, we'll figure it out. Let's continue on our side path, shall we? Oh, hello. There, Master. I'm I've learned a new way. Have you? What's the new way? Clark? Nice hit! Proud of you, Clark. That was big. That was big. Yeah! Bonk! Ah! Uh, get on me! Woo! And they're down. And we kill. Ugh. Okay, we're just kind of wading through here, hitting as many as we can. Really throwing them for a loop. There we go. Alicia, you gotta stop dying, dude. Yeah, Mr. No Cheeks kind of fell off the edge after I uh, got a little too aggressive with him and bonked him a little too hard. Strength in numbers arisen. You're a little late, and that's okay. New bronze bangles, huh? What do those do? Let's find out. Silver bands, bronze bangles. Those are not for me. But Rusader, guess what? I got you jewelry. Congrats. Yeah, you're not late. Everybody else was just early. Duh. Mm -mm. Do I really have to fight all these guys? I mean, I guess so, but I don't want to. Oh my god, that's a lot. Here, let's scoot out of there, gamers. Don't don't get surrounded. Okay, well. Ugh. Fine. Yeah, fire damage, baby. Now we're talking. Nice. That was actually pretty efficient. That was pretty good. Oh no, there's another one. Wait, when did I full heal? Huh. Listen, you're gonna take the rotted meat and you're gonna like it. That's a gift from me to you. That's the nicest thing I've ever done for anybody. And you're gonna look that gift horse in the mouth? Real? Sit down. Thank you. Clark! Ow, what is hitting me? Oh my God, what is hitting me? Holy shit. Hold on. Wait a minute. Uh-oh. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Ah! Help. Help. Hello? Come here, Rosader. Rosader! Hooray! Oh, man. Boo. Boo, Rosader. Wait, what? Oh, for fuck's sake. Some 
connection to this place. Yeah, that's fair. Too much rotten meat in our tummies. Okay, round two. Let's rock. Crusader, help me. Help me, Crusader, help me. Bonk. Bonk. Man, these guys don't like the two-handed weapons very much, do they? No, they don't. Man, warriors are just made for this part of the dungeon. Skeletons versus warriors? Not a very good matchup for the poor skeleton. <laughs> they don't like it. I do get to clap the troll again. That's the one upside of all this uh, running back. Wait a minute. Wasn't that a hat last time? What the hell? Did that change? Ow! Rude. Where'd you even get that big old hammer? Let me borrow it. Man, you guys are really getting surrounded here. Gears instance? What? I did not know that. That's wild. Combo time. Knock him down. Keep him down. <laughs> now, why would you help him back up after I put him on the ground, Clark? Clark, what was that about? Bro, we're going to steal your leg bone. He's just being a widow silly. I wish he'd stop. Hey, hey, hey! Man, she really loves dying today, huh? Please stop dying. Are you alive or are you just wiggling? He's just wiggling. Okay. Not a question I should have to ask. God forbid a girl be EP. God, women can't do anything around here. I won't even let them stay dead. <laughs> Not feeling it today. Oh, sorry. I didn't realize. All right, let's knock this dude off the edge. Fuck this guy. What is We're just gonna make it quick. Hey, what's up, bud? What? 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 Can I get a heal, please, Crusader? Stop being excited and sit down. Come on, one more hit. One more big boy hit. And whoop! No? Uh-oh. Can I get a widow help, Clark? Okay, thank you, Alicia. Yeah. Stop it. Stop it. Get some help, dude. Crusader, get up! Okay, we take a little healing. We're going to wait a second. I'm going to get my stamina back up. I'm going to let him re-engage and do what he needs to do. There we go. And okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Go over there, go over there. Yeah, yeah, good, good, good troll, good troll. Yeah! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Where are you going? Hi. If you don't get your ass back here, I swear... No, 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 let's get out! Well, okay. Whoa! Did you just kick Alicia off the cliff? I can't tell. Yep, sure did. Bye, Alicia. She's dead. Ain't nothing I can do about that. You don't sit the fuck down. Ow. Rosader, get up. Rosader, get up, I said. Well, Alicia's dead, dead. No! It's supposed to be off the cliff! Clark, what have you done? Keep knocking him around, baby. Wow, fuck. Let me get a little heal. Yummy. Haha, mm. <laughs> idiot. We're going to stay in the heal for a second. Oh, there it is. Did you kill him? You did kill him. That'll do it. 
Ball! 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 Yeah! That was rude. I said, fall down! Fuck's sake. Uh oh. Woo! Woo! Tired. Clark! Clark! Damn! Ah! On it! He doesn't care! He doesn't care! Clark, no! Oh, shit! Well, he's dead. We did kill him. I mean, Alicia's dead, but we did kill him. And that's gotta count for something. I'm working on it. Well deep this place. Just how far does it go? I mean, it is called the Everfall, dude. It probably goes pretty far down. Anytime. What's this? You had enough. You said, you know what? I'm clocking out early. Fuck this. I can respect that. <laughs> Sit down, you silly little bat. I'm working on it. You gotta give me a little time. It's gonna take me a second to get down there. If I just jump down, I'm gonna die. Hopefully we can get down there before she perishes. There is a path leading off this way as well. Man, they gotta start paying these trolls more. It's not fair that they never get paid enough to deal with my bullshit. Honestly, what's up with the economy these days, right? I'm working on not allowing him to swarm. Wow, you guys actually survived that knockup? Sit down, please. Thank you. No, don't come out. Sit down. I need fireballs. Fireballs. Fireballs, Rosader. Fireballs. Rosader. Fireballs. Yes, do it. Fire. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Ooh, nice try, big guy. Nice. Easiest win of my life. Oh, okay. I, I don't have a goofy little hat for you, but I might have new shoes for you. Does that count? Oh, some quirky, silly little shoes with magic defense. That's pretty nice. Quirky little shoes for you. Look at that, I got you those, uh, I got you those. One, two, buckle my shoe, three, four, buckle some more, five, six, Nike kicks. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit, come on. Uh, Rosader, now would be a great time to charge up a fireball, my guy. Went, went, went. Sit down. Get out of my head! Get out of my head! We have triumph. Any time. Good job, Clark. Are you guys still getting up? Oh my god. You filthy fucking peasants, stay in the earth! Strength in numbers arisen. Hey, you're welcome. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 not again, not again. We're going back. Come on, come on, Clark. Come on, Clark. Clark, come here. Clark, come here. Clark! Thank you, Clark. Clark! He threw my dog in the fire. Clark! Well, your dog was in my ass. I don't think my dog would fit in an ass. Well, you haven't seen my ass! <laughs> so dumb. Move, Clark, move! Well done, gamers. Well done. All right, let's get out there. Here we go. Three, two, one, and... That was my favorite dog! And you threw him in a fire! Dodge, dodge, dodge. We dodge that. Woo! Wah! 
Sit down! You're next! <laughs> Alright, that's everybody. Now we gotta get the wizards. Clark! Crusader! Yeah! 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 Now we're talking! Uh, no, 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 no! Ha! Uh oh. Hot, 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 hot! Ah, tasty healing. Wait, my healing! Whew. Okay, we're good. You don't get context. <laughs> The Adventure Zone! Okay, we got random skulls. What's that? I don't think I really need those for anything, so I'm gonna leave. Is that a large coin pouch? Well, 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 don't mind if I do. You'll never be large coin pouch. Large coin pouch. <laughs> Throw blast. Is that an explosive grenade? I think I just picked up a grenade. Wait a minute, what are they? Ooh, 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 grenades. Ooh, dragon's spit. Ceramic mug. Ooh, more free stuff. What is down here? I'm assuming there's enemies down here, hence the, uh-oh, uh if you fall down here, it's probably bad. Treasure, perhaps. Wait, this game has a Monster Factory episode? That's cool. Was that an ogre strategy? Is that o Tactics Ogre or whatever? I've heard of that game. This looks interesting. Ogre strategy is my favorite. <laughs> an agate, huh? <gasps> Ooh, pleasure. Silver wheat paste. I would love to get some gear down here. That would be very cool. What's this? Move, Rosader. All right, let's go flip that switch. Welcome back with your wafer cookies. Yeah, bonfire would go pretty hard right now, actually. After the assassins, double jump. Ugh. Oh, hey, yum. Oh, hey, yum. Whoa, we're making money now. I can go buy new gear for you guys and me when we're done here. Hey, can I? There we go. Was that downstairs? That's downstairs, right? Yep, 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 yep. Oh, it opened something else though. Uh oh. This single lever controls all the doors. Yeah, well, all the single levers. Oh shit, there was money up there. Hold on. We gotta go back up. One second, one second. If you read the strategy documents, your pawns will learn it. Oh! Is the ogre what I was just fighting, or was that a troll? Hmm. We should read it either way. Tools. My pawns have gained knowledge. I've learned a new way to fight burial. <laughs> hey, we opened it. Let's go. It was the right path. We're so smart. We got such a big, juicy brain. That's probably the bottom of the dun. Whoa. A cage? Well search the area. What are we caging? What are you buying? Oh, we love rotten meat. So good. Oh, we love dragon spit. So, something. Why are we shaking hands? What did I miss? Seems a little iffy to me. What's going on here? What are we caging? Things seem to be getting a little spooky. What? What? Cutscene? Is it a skeleton? Is it a skeleton? Yeah, it's a skeleton. What's up, dude? 
What, are you supposed to be a tough skeleton or are you a little baby? Whoa! Don't be weird. Oh, you're just a little baby. Why did I get a cutscene for one stupid skeleton? Give me that lever. Is he? He looks like a chump. Look at this dork. Look at this dweeb. He's done. It's over, buddy. It's over for you, big guy. Woo! Bonk! And now the skeleton doesn't exist. How skilled could he possibly be? Knock, knock. Coming in. Oh, this is free stuff right here, baby. Damn it, I said baby again. I'm gonna stop. I swear I'll stop. Oh, treasure. Whoa, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is that new me armor? That might be new me armor. I do love me armor. Oh, boo. It's for Rusaders. It's way better than what you got. Is it like an undershirt? Oh, it's an undershirt. It's clothing. Oh, five extra magic resist, extra striking resist. You get lightning, ice, fire resist, and you already have light and dark resist. So you resist everything. You lose slow resist and get disarm resist, I guess. For you. If you weren't wearing this goofy little thing, you'd actually probably look pretty cool right now. Yeah, you would, but you do have to have armor on. Sorry. Stick it out, champ. We'll get you there. You didn't have to break it, but okay. I guess I'll join you for smacking things needlessly. I'll ill miss this dank place when we move on. Oh? But you will miss it. Be sure we carry ample storage oil to keep the lantern burning. Silence, Rosader. I know what I'm doing. I will diss the smock. Don't make fun of this smock. How dare you? Are we finishing this dungeon today? You better believe we're finishing this dungeon today. This is sort of Legend of Zelda adjacent, I guess. Yeah. Is there a boss down here? This feels like a boss room. Doesn't this feel like a boss room to you? Ah, uh, this is where our good friend Alicia died. Clark. This looks interesting. Hmm. What if that uh, ogre and or troll uh, dropped anything when he died? Oh, treasure. Treasure, perhaps. Oh, now that's got to be equipment for me, right? Come on. It's better than my greaves for some reason. By like a big margin. Cool. I got my boots a plus two ass kicking. All right. Well, I guess nothing to it but to get in there. See what's up. <laughs> Alicia, are you still down here? <laughs> he asked, knowing the answer. Troll, are you down here? Did you drop any loot? Whoa. Okay, no troll. Got it. Alicia, are you with us? Are you in the room right now? Spell spell something on the Luigi board if you're here. Flame Servant's Throne. That's my crystal now. Uh, embed this port crystal in the ground any place save a dungeon. And you can use a fairy stone to return there in an instant. That's cool. Mm -mm -mm. Cool. Oh, cool. They're fighting in the center of the earth. I got you. Welcome back from your nap nap. Behold my whack whack. Bonk. 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 We love being able to hit everything in a 360 degree arc. Hey, don't you touch that Rusader. I will send you into the sky. So help me God. Oh, what's wrong, bud? Oh, I see. I got you, champ. Hey, Rosader, you might want to start casting something instead of throwing shit randomly. That's not going to help us a ton. I'm not going to lie.
Was there supposed to be a cutscene there? Ah! Whoop. Ah! I didn't get to finish my move! My special move! Yep. Yep. Hell yeah. And. Ugh. I need to interact with a glowing bowl. I thought I did. I thought I did. Crusaders, if you don't quit getting into fucking trouble, I'm gonna leave you to die. Stop doing that. Stop running into melee with the zombies that you know like grabbing. Why do you want to get grabbed, you little weirdos? Sit down! That'll do him. Ooh, coin pouch. Hugs are great, that's why. Oh, you're one of those, huh? Hmm. I gotta go interact with the bowl. No, we like to do a little trolling. Uh. Alright, I'm at the bowl. Examine. Hello, bowl. Oh, there's something below it. Oh, maybe this fell down. Oh. Wait, I think I remember this from the first time I played this game. Oh, yeah, we just gotta run, right? Like, we're supposed to just get out. Like, we can't win this fight, I don't think. Yeah, bye. Uh, uh, help. Help. Please help me. Crusader! Crusader! Help! No, Clark, we're leaving. We're not fighting. Come on, guys. Come on, we're not fighting. Come on. Uh-uh. Break line of sight. We're done with that. Nope, we're still leaving. Crusader, if you don't quit casting and run. Run! I swear to fuck, if you stay there and die, I'm gonna be very angry at you. Woo! Oh, the undead are coming too. That's great. This is great. This is awesome. We love this. We love this. Yeah, baby. Everybody loves a little bit of undead just spawning and rushing you. Do we die forever? I have no idea, but we're about to find out. I cannot take much more. Crusaders, come on. Oh, you're already down. No, Clark's down. You know what? Leave Clark, Crusaders. We're going. Crusaders, what are you doing? For fuck's sake! If you don't get your ass out of that swarm of undead and follow me right now. You know what? Fine. Clark, keep up. Let's go. Oh, you goobers. I don't know if I'm going to be able to... Res Can I respawn you later? I guess we'll find out. Anyway, bye. See you guys. Sorry, Rosaders. Woo! Wait, the Rosaders alive. Come on. You're still all the way down there. What are you doing? Oh, God. All right. Well, it's the Walking Dead down there. So see ya. No. You stayed. That's on you. Why did you stay down there? I gotta keep breaking line of sight on these weird tentacles. Ow! Tentacles. Woo! My stamina's running out fast. Don't you want to save us? We're so cute. Um, you know, let me think about that for a second while I run from these weird, eerie mouth tentacle things. Uh, oh, you know what's funny? I just came to a conclusion. No. <laughs> no, I don't. I want to run. Oh, wrong lever.
Maybe this is okay, actually. Maybe I can go back this way and get out. Yeah, now we're talking. Are there no tentacles in here? Okay, we're safe. He hates me! Yeah, I'll be back later once I get my milk and my cigarettes or whatever. <laughs> Ugh, can you guys please go away? A bat? Are you shitting me? A bat? Yeah, get out of there, Roos! Run! Oh, he's moving, moving. Okay. I will thumbs down this stream. I swear to God. <laughs> My conscience, I cannot get up, you dick. Hey, where's Alicia? I am deeply sorry. That's rough. Ooh. Hey, pick this up. I'll go at once. Pick this up. Pick up whatever this book is. I like book. Pick up book. Pick up book. Pick up book. All right, I gotta give something away so I can pick up book. Oh, free money! Nice. I guess she got eat eated by the uh, weird tentacle monsters. But hey, we're all alive. We did it. Yeah, I think Alicia's dead, dead. Well, let's pick up a new pawn. A light in the furthest depths, you say? Yup. In truth, even we pawns know precious little of the Everhold. I can say with utmost certainty, though, the light you speak of is newly come. Oh, how do you know? Have you been down there? Aberration will give rise to great calamity hence. Wait, there's music in the city now. Finally, music's here. We shall redouble our efforts here and keep vigilant for further signs. Right, there's music now. Night, Daffy. Hey, look. New pawns. That was easy. Oh. Damn, there's a bunch of quests to kill undead, and I kind of missed out on a lot of that. My bad. Will these pawns just join me? I don't know if I need another fighter. A word, sir. Da -da! Where'd you come from? Where did you come from? Hi, Sir Duncan. Are you the arisen? I bring a message from the Duke himself. Tell me! His grace has judged your feat in slaying the Hydra most laudable. I thought you were going to say laughable, and I was like, really? Tell your grace he can come out here and 1v1 me. The worm hunt. You may now accept orders from Sir Maximilian, captain of the hunt. Mm. Bring this writ to Sir Maximilian outside the castle gates. He will instruct you further. The document confers okay. the status of hunter upon you. Carry it on your person always. Bro, I'm the Arisen. I think hunter might be a little beneath my station, but okay. Got it. How's progress? I mean, it's going. We just completed the Everfall, whatever that is. Uh, and I am probably going to switch my class to Assassin because I can't stand having zero stamina. It's killing me. I mean, if you like the sound of me rambling and just incessantly, like, screaming at video games, then I'm glad it's been of service to you, Al Messages. <laughs> I think I want to hire... Is this a mage? How do I know if this is a mage or a wizard? I want to hire whatever your class is, Rosader, so I can upgrade you to your next tier. Oh, you know I'm playing Dragon's Dogma 2 as soon as I get perms. And as soon as it's out. But I want to beat this one first because I never did beat the first one. I think this is about as far as I've gotten. What's this? Oh. Free Fairy Stone. Assassin gets buffs for playing solo? What if it's just me and my one pawn? Like, just me and the Rosader? Does Assassin get buffs for that or no? Birdie, I don't think this is very far in at all. This is still, like, starting stuff. And good question, dude. I'm not sure. No. No. I don't like you guys. I'm just tired of you dying over and over again. So I'll upgrade you as a, as a treat. You need to be absolutely solo, so I'd have to ditch the Rosaders, huh? That'd be pretty fucked up. 
One day soon, Ghosty Jack. One day soon. The pawns that fought alongside him must I be about somewhere. I suppose the merchants have need of open space to ply their trades. Don't you? No, no, no. Don't, don't, don't send me hearts. Don't act like I'm being nice to you. I will go assassin and go solo. Do not test me. <laughs> I think this is a higher tier wizard. And I don't want one of those. What are you? Is there a way to tell? Can I help you? Uh, no, no. Can I help you? I just want to see what you are. Oh yeah, you're a sorcerer. No, I don't need you. Unless we want to lead the Rosaders to support, and we could take the sorcerer, and then I could switch to assassin, and then we have a warrior. A sorcerer, a pseudo healer. Hmm. Hmm. That could work. All right, you're coming with us, whatever you're, uh, Joel. I am honored to try. Yeah, you're welcome. Stay honored. Oh, well, oops. There's somebody right there. Oopsies. <laughs> All right, let's go swap classes real quick, and then we'll uh, we'll continue the story a bit and see, uh, see how far we can get. I don't know how far we're going to go today, but, you know, we'll get somewhere at some point. I tested out Warrior. It's just a little slow. I do like the big, chunky, meaty hits. That's pretty fun. Wait, where am I at? Who are you, kid? Talk is. Some hero fit to slay the third year, is it? That's a good question. Sure. Yeah, that's me. Sir Forder? Many of these are like to be I hate your name. Bye. You yep. don't want to go that way. All right, where am I at? I want to go back to the main city. Oh, here we go, here we go. So we go this way to get back to the main city. Or maybe not? Hmm. What kind of monster names their child Pip? A true demon. Ah! And comrades! Clark, carry that for me. Mmm, coin pouch. Pip is very medieval orphan core. Don't say that about Pip. Let him have a chance at life, all right? Before you call him a medieval orphan core. That's fucked up and evil of you. Seriously, what's the easiest way? This way. Okay, we're going to go this way. I love Clark. Get shoved, get shoved, get rotated, guard. You just run past him and just immediately trip him. Plants his fucking face in the stones. <laughs> Who among you has seen the dragon? Hello, hello. Hello, I tried out warrior. I've decided, no thank you. Swap me, we're going assassin. Yes. I don't want to be naked. Oh, wait a minute. Do we want dual daggers and shield, or do we want sword and shield? I guess sword and shield, but with assassin skills sounds pretty cool. And then we'll obviously equip our current gear. Mmm, that's kind of a cool look, though. Mmm, what do I lose? I get a magic resist, I lose two armor, I lose striking resist. So I, I traded two armor and striking resist for magic. Nah, it's worse. We will not be doing that. Put some pants on, Ruse. What are you doing? And a cape. At your pick, in your life, what will it be today? Crop top returns? Great question. Good luck at work. Intimate strike. Whoa. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. You get different moves for different abilities. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I could purchase a bow. I could go one-handed sword and a bow. That sounds kind of cool, actually. Oh, that sounds kind of cool, actually. Hmm. Oh, you're leaving work. Yeah, you know, same thing, really. Let's be honest. <laughs> Ha! <laughs> 
Huh. Especially effective when combined with... Is there any... Please, God, give me something that'll increase my stamina. Oh, new chain of sword slashes? Don't mind if I do. Sword and mace skill. Hmm. Dagger, dagger. We'll stick to sword for now, and we'll learn a couple sword moves. Doing one-handed sword is kind of fun, actually. I never see games that allow you to do one-handed sword with no shield in the offhand, and I kind of love that. Oh, I keep Tusk Toss from Fighter. Oh. That's pretty cool, actually. Wait, no. I want this to be Intimate Strike. We're getting rid of Blink Strike. Because this one does the same thing, I think. Right? So we'll do that as broad cut. Cool. Potokiri says, hey, Ruse, not sure if you nabbed it or not already, but standard fighter gets an augment at rank five that increases your equipment load. Uh oh, what will it be today? Um, your pick? OK, let me change my vocation back to fighter. Do I get to keep it for free? Yep, I do. No, I'm not going to change my equipment. I just want to learn a set skill. Mm, fitness. Oh. Oh, well, I'm running low on stats here. Oh, falls mitigate harm. That's cool. Deflects attacks. Oh, blocking damages my opponent. Huh. Interesting. Hmm. Hey, thank you for the delicious soup, by the way, Fartakiri. Hmm, so good. So I'd have to rank up and fight her one more time, huh? Oh, that's what those little, like, marks are. Those little red marks on my class. I see. So maybe we stay as fighter for one more level? Listen, I'm going to put clothes on in a second. He's got scars, just like me, for real, for real. I'm actually pretty far along the level of fighter for rank up, I think. So maybe we stay as fighter for one more level. Shield storm. Huh. Interesting. Uh, let's change our equipment. Come again soon. Still don't have a helmet. Maybe we should go buy a helmet. You guys want to get a helmet? What do we think? Hmm. Then again, the helmets in this town kind of suck. Ooh, more quests? There's always more quests. Night! Oh, wait. That's an actual escort. Ugh. Okay, Mercedes, where are you at? Me, I've no love of magic and it's iron and steel. I agree. Iron and steel, baby. Let's go. What do you got for helmets, my guy? Oh, you got new stuff here, huh? Ooh. Wait a minute. Built a jerkin's kind of cool, kind of interesting. You got any armor? Hmm, leather chest guard, it's not bad. Riveted coat. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Assembled vest. Interesting. Leather waist strap. <laughs> that gives a lot of armor for some reason. Oh, that's interesting. That's actually only for assassins and rangers. So it's a ranger only. Oh, this is a lot of ranger only gear. Huh. You're nearly overburdened, which is why your stamina runs out so fast. Man, they hate me. When does Rosader get an upgrade? You know what? Right now. Let's do it. It's Rosader time. All right, Rosader. We're not going to put a dumb hat on you yet. Eventually. Eventually. Let's see what you got as far as a scholar's coat. That actually looks a little better than what you got going on. We're going to buy you one of those. We're going to buy you. Actually, like your, your bangles are fine. 
Well, the workers' gloves aren't bad. Actually, they're a huge upgrade. All right, we'll get you workers' gloves. We'll get you that. Kind of want you to have better pants, honestly. Oh, those aren't bad. What if we got you scholar boots? Actually, those are worse than the boots we found for you. So let's get you some denim hosen. And a cape. You deserve a little cape. Ooh, a little scholar cape? A little nerd's cape? Or a mahogany cape? That's pretty caster looking. <gasps> Assassin drip. I'm going to get you the mahogany cape. No jewelry, though. There you go, little Rosader. Are you happy? New outfit, new fit. Bam! You are upgraded. Let's go! We want a tiny little hat? Uh, I don't think this guy has any tiny hats for you. Sorry. Nah, he's just got like a white cap. You look like a dork with that. Oh, wait! Wizard's hat. Featherhood? Hmm. You could look like a little dork. Could look like, look like a little dork. Or I could give you this hood. Hmm. Hmm. That's an expensive tiny hat. We'll give you one dorky hat. You're welcome. Don't say I never did anything for you. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. I don't want to see if he has any good weapons I would use. A broadsword, huh? Hmm. Interesting. Iron shield. I like new shields. Oh, that's a magic bow only. Oh, and a long bow only. Oh, there's the short bow, a sylvan bow. That's kind of cool. A wooden wall. <laughs> How do you fare? How do you? Where, where are you? What did you? Wait, what? Huh? Oh, Mercedes. Hello. Didn't expect to see you there. Bye, Wolf. Good luck. Are your travel preparations complete? This last year, Grand Soren's not tall. Have your pick. What will it be today? All right, let's store just a bunch of junk. I'm just going to store basically everything I have because I'm tired of carrying it. Okay, cool. Mm. Okay, I think we're good. What will it be? Have your pick. Any you like. What will it be today? Damn, 500 gold, dude? 500 gold, dude? Understood. Damn. Yeah, so you can store items in the inn for some reason. Ah, Mercedes. Fancy seeing you here. Oh my gosh, you stayed the night? What are you doing here? You monster. <laughs> hey, what's up, dude? Hey, old friend. Been some time. Trust you've been well? Well enough, yeah. But come, if it was idle twittering you'd wanted, you'd have sought a prettier bird than this old crow. Mm. Crows bring tidings, most oft grim. Me, I bring you work. <laughs> Still grim, I'm afraid. Well, I like your attitude, Mason. Naturally. You seem pretty all right. Nowadays, word they've a man inside the castle. Oh. Be true, 
He'll have need to leave the castle eventually to meet with the others. Ah. All I ask is that you keep watch. If you see someone leaving the castle, shadow them. I only have need of your eyes. Follow them. Skulking about is more my line than yours, I know. But pray, lay your chivalry aside this once. I no! I myself, but there's aught has me away from Grand Sorin for a time. Nothing for it, I fear. Oh, you just, you're worried I'm going to be in danger and you don't want to be there. I get it. Tread carefully, friend. Okay, I'll do that some other time. Right now, I need to do this little quest with uh, Mercedes. What are we doing, Mercedes? Seriously, Mercedes, where are we going? Oh, escort Mercedes. One, uh, you've one chance to boost the companion's affinity by escorting the save later ascension. Earn a reward of five thousand gold and three thousand experience. What does boosting affinity do for me? I wonder. Will you be my best friend and follow me on quests if I s if I boost your affinity? The fort is the bandits' fort, right? We're going to the bandits' fort. No, no. Thank you, Joel. Oh, we're gaming. Is Shadow Fort this one here? No, wait, down here, I mean. No, wait, down here? Oh, that's such a long walk. Where's Shadow Fort? Boosting affinity prevents you from getting married. You get married in this game? What? Why? Do I have to? Is there an option to say no? Night, Kiyosuke. All right, now show me the way. I've, I've marked you as my map. Apparently, I need to go. Wait, nope. What? You're a shadow fort. You will be married. Uh oh, here we go. Okay, so it is the one down here. So I need to go all the way down here, and then I need to run west from the mountain way castle. So let's get it. You can romance Madeline. Uh, uh, uh. I mean Madeline's fine, but uh the beating heart of all grances. Leave it to me, Master. The Duke's burden is great. Between his duties as sovereign and the worm hunt, a good start to any task is talking. There are teleports in this game, yeah. There's only a few types of games games that let you fish and games that let you get married. Well, apparently, this is the marriage one. Hey, Rosader, what are you uh, struggling with over there, sport? Mum. You can get married to shop in BCs? That's kind of funny. I like that. Affinity can happen with people you do not expect. Huh. Hey, guys. Okay, so that's Tusk Toss. Wait, did I forget to equip my skills? Sure did. All right, well, we've lost a few abilities, but that's fine. Whoa, whoa, don't be weird, dude. Okay. Mailwidge. A lot of people end up with a blacksmith as their beloved, and rightfully so. Do I get anything for my marriage? Like discounts with the blacksmith, for example. Do you know the goblins ill like fire? It's true. I've seen it. Hey! Hey! Don't hit Mercedes! Who wouldn't marry Andre from Dark Souls? Shopkeepers are the most chill people. I'd marry a couple shopkeeper NPCs for games. I'm having a new Dragon's Dogma run where my beloved is the... There's a Jester character in this game? What the fuck? We're near half 
between the encampment and the capital, I'd warrant. But what do I get for marriaging? Hmm. This place must have seen a ferocious battle. It's true, it did. It was me. I was the ferocious was battle. Goblin ambush ahead, Risen. Stat buffs, discounts, items. Hmm. So, like, if you married um, Madeline, I imagine you get a discount in the shop. But what if you married, like, Mercedes? Mercedes doesn't sell anything. What do you get for that? Hello. Come down. Come down, please. Come down, please. Thank you. Whoa, relax. We don't need the slow motion. Damn. Damn. Marriage is exclusively plot based. I absolutely not. Uh, cool lady nightwife. What's your opinion about Elden Ring's Ronnie ending, aka the waifu ending? Um. So here's the thing. I never actually beat Elden Ring. I got to the fire giant mountain and then I stopped for some reason. I do want to beat it at some point. Francis is overrun with brigands. You get a French girl roomie in your house? That's a terrible reward. That sounds like a punishment. <laughs> Keep an eye turned to the shadows. Can you marry multiple people? I doubt it. Oh, shit! You really peeled me right out of the air there. I thought I had you. I was like, watch me intercept this harpy midair. And that harpy said, nope. That was a waste of time. The French in shambles. I'm kidding. French people are cool. It's fine. I just don't need anybody rooming with me. That sounds like a hassle. Come down. Thank you. Can you marry the homies? I highly doubt it since there's like a huge power imbalance between the pawns and the arisen. And also the pawns aren't necessarily sentient. Well, that is literally the last person I wanted to get hit by that boulder. But I guess it all worked out in the end. We're almost there. Okay, let's keep it moving. Anytime. See you later, Ciceru. Hey guys, another chest. Thanks. Ooh, another knife. Interesting. I don't know what I do with that, but I have it. Mercedes, please. Please! Thank you. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ooh, a chest. Oh, a fairy hood. You guys want to have a fairy hood? Let's see if you can wear it. Let's see what it does. Oh, wait. I have to give it to you. It's worse. Sorry, guys. Oh, what a goofy little hat. It loses your brim, too. No, thank you. Yank you with no brim. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> Oh, the knife is for buttering my toaster strudels. I see, I see. That's the sound of me speeding down this highway. I can run much longer when I'm not overburdened. This is nice. Yeah, yeah, I know. Relax. I'm vigilant as they come. I don't eat toaster strudels. I don't think so, Banana Web. I probably just lose, like, um, ingratiation with them, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I forget what it is, like, reputation or whatever. I probably lose reputation if they die on the quest. Hey, what's this do? Wait a minute. What's this do? There's a chest there. We're dragging Mercedes all the way down there is probably a bad idea, right? Right. Uh oh. Woo! I fucked up. I fucked up. Unless. Let's go, baby. We do the old fade away. Give him a little love tap. Woo! 
Ow, ow, ow! That hurt, dude. Don't do that. Hey, we're tier five! We did it! We made it a level five and fighter! Whoa, 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 whoa! Combos! How did I do that? How did I do that? Oh, you can delay attacks and it changes your attack pattern. Interesting. I did not know that. So I can go whop, whop, or I can go whop. Wait, no, it's whop, whop, whop. Hmm, whop, 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 whop. Interesting. Uh, 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 uh. How did I do that? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know how I did that. Huh. Oh, well. And are we back at the main gate? Did I fuck up? I think I fucked up, gamers. I did. I did. I did. We have to turn around. That's okay. At least we know there's a shortcut now. Tap it when the animation ends. I'm, I'm, I'm at the animation end. I don't know how to do it! Damn it. First one, and then pause. Yeah. Oh, you have to do it after the heavy. Okay, so it's this, pause, that, swing, swing, swing. Got it, got it, got it. I like that he grips the sword with two hands. I think that's pretty cool. See you, Shields. Good luck. Oh, treasure. I did not realize there was loot down here. <laughs> oh, another knife. Listen, I love knives as much as the next guy, but come on. Parkour. Man, this game was so ahead of its time, I can tell. If I played this game in like 2012 when it came out, I would have lost my mind. Give us some rotten meat at least. Why? What do you need rotten meat for? That's my rotten meat. What have you done to earn it? What are you even going to do with it? I believe you. What's down there? Oh, it's a river. Is that traversable? Or is that just like you fall, you die? I think that's a fall, you die type of deal. He stars us! You did die and come back. However, you died and I had to respawn you. So really, I mean, I think I deserve the credit there more than you. You really did the easy part, the dying part. I did the we come back. A craftsman must know his tools. A warrior his weapons. That's a good attack. I like that. I like how it fades you away. So you can get out of a, you know, bad situation pretty quick. I'll take that. Plants of all kinds grow at the tree's feet. Gorblins! Here there be gorblins. Ooh! Didn't think that was gonna do damage, but here we are. Tis a land rife with spots where useful materials may hide. Goblin! I can't believe it's taken them 11 years to get to the next one. Are you guys coming down here? Or like, what are we doing? Mercedes, where are you? Okay, that's a good combo. I love that. Are you alive? Nope, okay. A goblin horn. Dude, I love doing that heavy attack there at the end. It's so good. So wait for La Lost Planet 4. Lost Planet 4. Um, which one is Lost Planet? Man, that's a cool combo. I like that a lot. Oh, yeah, they did make a Dragon's Dogma online. I forgot about that. So that's the boss. Come get some, boss baby. Let's go. Blah, blah, blah. Give him the fade away. Hey, cool shield, dude. Try this. 
<laughs> oh, that's kind of fucking funny, dude. That was kind of fucking funny. He said, block! I said, no, don't. I kind of didn't like that little squeal he gave at the end. That was actually kind of sad feeling. Oh, the Frozen Planet game with giant bugs. I played the demo for that. It was super fun. Night, Johan. See you later. Man, yeah, Lost Planet seemed really interesting. What does this lead to? What'd you say? Did you call me stupid right before I, like, peeled your flesh off your body? That's really funny. <laughs> How quirky of you. Oh, it's a little hand pickaxe. That's cute. Crates may hold alt of use. Oh, I wonder if that ore's worth a lot. I guess you probably use it for crafting, or maybe it's for upgrading equipment or something. Many plants mm. grow in the shade of tall trees or in dense woods. Interesting. Okay, so I guess that was not the path to where I thought it was. There's a path to my north. Okay, north. Another forgotten game like Dragon's Dogma was all. Oh. You know, I've never really kept up with Capcom super carefully, but it's cool to hear about everybody who seems to know their history and, like, the interesting games that they put out. I, uh, I should definitely keep a better eye on the company, but I tend to only really look at, like, their really big stuff. Not, like, on purpose. I'm just not deep diving into most, like, really big companies. I tend to keep an eye out more so for indie titles and things like that. Preferably without getting too, too wet. Who knows, Yuniji? <laughs> no worries either way. Man Swallowing Falls. What a name. Uh, is this the way? This must be the way. Okay, party time. At least you're getting Dragon's Dogma too. Very true. I'm what? I don't think that's going to stop me from using my lantern, though. Is it? Oh, I put my lantern away. Uh-oh. No, I didn't. We're good. Gave the water god's altar its name not long ago. Gave the water god's altar its name. Uh. Yeah, Hades 2. Yeah, yeah. I've seen a couple trailers for it. It seems interesting. I still really want to play uh, Skull, the hero slayer, though. Each outstrips the next in skill and judgment. They are formidable. Uh. Unlike your pawns, they will a plenty. They'll not bend. Okay, if you say so, Mercedes. I shall restore your health. Hold I've on. never played a Dino Crisis game. Yeah, Hades 2 looks really exciting. I'm excited for that. Uh, I want to play Skull the Hero Slayer at some point on stream. What else am I excited for in the future? Let me think. There's a couple games that are coming out soon. Definitely Dragon's Dogma 2. Uh, I want to play Risk of Rain Returns, but I haven't been able to get Herms yet. We'll see. Hey, rats. Rats! Have I ever been in here? I don't think I've been in here. Maybe this is the wrong way. I guess we'll find out. The music here is pretty chill. Stop! Wait, I want to see if this leads to anything. Don't hit it yet. Okay, well, all right. Potent green waddish. Ah, oh, okay, the undead. Get in there, Clark! Nice job, Clark. Proud of you. Uh, I want that clean cloth. I want that eyedropper. I want that hair spud milk. I want that. I want that. And I want your coin pouch. And then your coin pouch. Nice! Oh, and another coin pouch. Damn, there's a lot of loot down here. All right. Very good. My first experience of DC1. DC. 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 What is a game you wish you could experience for the first time again? Uh, Ocarina of Time. 
will get nowhere till we found Oh, I need a oh, okay, I need a hollow key. Got it, got it, got it. Ocarina of Time is one of the games I definitely wish I could experience for the first time again. Warcraft 3. Um Little Big Planet. Uh Wow. Guild Wars 2. Mm. What else? Can you not? Um, I'm sure there's other things. There's a lot of games. Honestly, the problem I have with games is I don't like playing games twice. I feel like I, I memorize most games well enough that there's no real point in me playing it more than once. So I struggle to engage with the game if I've already beat it. Uh -huh. And that makes it inherently difficult for me to really enjoy games at all the second time around. So most games, really, I would like to play for the first time again. Damn, the Ice Sword's really kind of doing work right now. Damn! Damn! Not bad at all. Clark, you okay, buddy? Oh, a cutscene. Oh. Oh, bad. Oh, this is bad. I thought that was going to be good. This is bad. Let's party, baby. Come get some! Woo! Damn, we're tearing it up right now. We're really just wading through these guys. No fear. Damn, we just tore that apart. Uh, I used to replay Hotline Miami every year, huh? Interest. Oh, gauntlets. I like gauntlets. I want gauntlets. Hold on, one second. Oh, ho, ho, ho. we're nighting up a little bit. Good pierce resist, good strike resist. I lose my elemental resistances, but fuck it, I'll take it. Yeah, guard our hands. Um, no comfort game, nothing you to play just to relax. So the reason I gravitate toward competitive online games and multiplayer games and MMOs is because I feel like they don't really get super old for me. Because there's always some more content to participate in. Something like Ocarina of Time, I've beaten maybe twice in my life. Um, because at this point, like, even though I played it when I was like a fucking child, I memorized basically the entire game. So there's essentially no reason to ever play it again. Uh, like, I could tell you how to beat that game start to finish in my memory right now. Where if I play something like, I don't know, fucking League of Legends, which, I mean, after playing for a long time, I am bored of it, but I still played it for years. Um, it's different every time because it's down to like how you interact with the people who are playing that game more so than the game itself. You know what I mean? What is cuisineer? Qu cuisineer? That's something to do with cuisine, no doubt. Qu cuisine in here. Cuisine here. Damn it. That's a hard word to say. Alright, somewhere around here, there's got to be the token that opens this door, right? Hey, Evan H, welcome in. Thank you for the membership. I have a hard time playing games multiple times over for similar reasons. That was me with Dead by Daylight. Ah, I could never latch on to Dead by Daylight. I kind of just hate playing Survivors. It bores the shit out of me. I like playing the killer, okay. <sighs> I tell myself I would play those games again, Saya, but the reality is I probably won't because the game just doesn't change enough to keep me focused. Uh, it's also why I love roguelikes because they change a lot every time you play. I've actually never done a speed run. I've considered it. Um, one type of gameplay loop I do really enjoy that does keep things fresh for me. I see you out there, dude. I wish I had a bow right now. Um, is Nuzlocke's. It's like the only way I play uh, Pokemon games at this point. 
Okay, we're good there. All right, let's do this. Clark! You got me hit! Clark! Dodge! Oh, shit! Whoa! Do not want to fall in that water. I do not want to fall in that water. I just want to kill these guys. Don't do it. I hope you don't like water. Yeah, you don't. Yeah, you don't. Ow! What hit me? You dick! Bye. Aha. Uh -huh. Ring of Azure. Interesting. What are you doing down there, big guy? Oh, here he comes. Okay. Let's wait a second. Let's see. Is it hardcore Nuzlocke specific? No. No, I'm not good enough Pokemon to do hardcore Nuzlocke. Scoundrel. I think I've heard of that, but I can't remember if I've seen gameplay of it. Sounds cool, though. I would be interested in trying it out. There we go. All done with that guy. This place is pretty cool, actually. I don't think I've been down here, but I like it a lot. Oh, our first helmet, perhaps? So it is. How very Griffith coded, but I'll take it. Oh, did Mercedes die down here? How? What? To what? Oh, Mercedes must have fallen in. Got it. Okay, got it. I think I'm dead here, right? Or does it just set me back up? Sets me back up. Got it. You're back. Why are the lizard men immune to that, I wonder? Interesting. Oh, I'm sopping wet. I'm like, why is my torch not working? Now I get it. There we go. All right. Mm, thank you for that delicious hot dog. Don't do it. Don't be weird, dude. I told you not to be weird, dude. What's up, Clark? Two hours of work left. That's brutal, gamer. What the hell are you doing, my dude? Did I not cut your tail off? Why? Are, where are you going? Well, he had a bomb. <laughs> oh no. All this water, man. What the fuck? Oh shit. Boss fight. Save or quit. I just want to save and continue. I can't. Okay, boss fight then. Maybe I have to wait for combat to end. Good taste, Genevieve. It's a good game. Dude, this looks like the uh, scene in Castlevania where they fight the Cyclops before they find Sifa. It's kind of cool, actually. Where are you, dude? I'm tired of the combat music. Uh, I gotta go finish off this other story or this combat's never gonna technically end. Was that a little guitar riff in there? Wait a second. Where are you, dude? Where is he? Thank you. Clark, do you see? Hey, hey. Douchebag, get up here. Are you seriously just going to sit down there and keep me from saving? Can you kill him, Joel? Thank you. Again, more. More! More! Guys, please. Aim. Get him, Rosaders! Yeah! Great job, gamers. I cannot equip a bow. I'm technically still just a fighter. 
The fight's over now, right? Party time. We do our RP walk up to him. What's up, big guy? We should probably heal first, huh? Let's heal. Mmm, a nut! Purges poisons, recovers a bit of health. Mm -mm -mm. Let's do this. Hey, big guy. No, he isn't. Let's go, baby! Get his knees, Clark! Okay, he's on fire. See, he's not too powerful. We got this. Easy. Hell yeah! You're dead as fuck, big guy! It's feeble mind is weak to sorcery. Good to know. Well, that wasn't good. Did he lose a tusk? Hell yeah! Whoa, 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 that was close. Give me your little tusk. Give me your little tusk. Give me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah. Man, he's really stomping. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh. Ah. Ow. Hey, guys, are you going to come over here? Or like, what are we doing? Whoa. Yeah, it's party time, baby. Yeah. Whoa. Clark, get up. Stop fucking around. Yeah! Fuck your thing! Wait, did I paralyze him? Holy shit, I think I did. Get his legs, Clark! Oh, I'm on it. Oh, I'm going for it, baby. Here we go. Ah, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. He didn't fall. You lied. Shit. Clark. Cut his hands off. Hell yeah, baby. Let's go. I'm going to cut that fucking hand off. Yeah, put him down. Did we just break that fucking pillar? That's insane. Shit. Shit. Get up, get up, get up. Ah! Woo, that hurts. Come here, Clark. Whoa. Clark, stop falling down. I'll grab hold of it. Woo! This dude's about to be a holiday ham. Let's go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go, Clark. Get him. Let's do this, Clark. Yeah! Oh, he's mad. Come get some, big guy. What you got? Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, he found his club. Huh. Shit. Fuck. Oh, he's making it hard to hang on here. I'm gonna hop off and go get the others. I've learned a new way to fight Hey Clark! Oh fuck! Give me that fire buff. Let's do this. Yeah. Wah! Shit. 
Wait. Can I throw a fire bomb? I have an idea. Huh? Ah! Well, I hit him pretty hard. Ah! Ah! Come on! Give me that head! Yeah! 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 Oh yeah. God, I love the big boss battles in this game. It feels so fucking cool every time. God damn. Look at this big ugly mug. Bye. <laughs> Thank you forever. Bye. Damn, that's such a cool fight. God, that's so cool. I like your bones, dude. You got some solid bones, buddy. Hmm? Did you say something arisen? No, I was just looking to see if there's any loot. Thanks for asking, though, dude. Hey, what this? What the hell? Oh my god, he's still sinking! He's heading for the center of the earth. What is this? Like a little side tunnel down here. Is that water, like, death? Yep, yeah, okay, well, we're not going that way. Though, that tunnel does have... Huh. Alright, uh, nah. We, we, there's gotta be some way to, like, travel through the water later in the game, I guess. Because that has something. Yeah, I'm sure the Cyclops will be fine. If you let him sleep it off for a little bit, I'm sure uh, he'll recover from his uh, bone hurdy disease and his lack of skin. Just gotta let him rest for a little while. Mm -mm -mm. I wonder if this area has the medallion for back in the early part of the dungeon that I needed. Because there's a couple chests here. Ooh. Piece of candy. What do we got? Ring of pure pure. And a violet ring. I'm finding a lot of rings. How weird. What are the rings about? What do we got going on here, gamers? Uh, debilitation resistance. That's a lot of debilitation resistance, actually. Um, ice resist. Lightning resist. Uh, and the violet ring has just higher magic resist, I guess. Huh. Weird. Hmm. These are not players following me, Amy. These are uh, NPCs. They're called um, pawns. If I were playing in the online version, these would actually be characters created by other players. So you know how I created the Rusader? These would be like their personal companions. So based on what classes or quests they had completed together with their pawns, if I adopted those pawns into my party, they would know about those quests and be able to inform me of how to complete them and things like that. Which is pretty cool, actually. Clearly I'm missing something in this dungeon, and I'm not sure what. There's gotta be a way. Hmm. I think I hear a sleepy little lizard man. Hmm. Now I know I hear a sleepy little lizard man. Hey, what are you doing down there, bud? What's going on? Oh, wait a minute. See that? Over there. There's something. I, grant you bite. I 
need you guys actually to move out of my way. Move out of my way. Go away. Go over there or something. Go there. Go. Shoe. Bye. Guys, if you don't get the fuck out of my way. Ugh! Alter Slade. Okay, that's big. I think that's something we needed. Nice, 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 nice. Who's Honk Shoe? Me, 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 me. Oh, it's a little Gerard. He's taking a little Gerard nap. Wow, look at him go. Okay, so now that I have the Alter Slate, I assume I need to use that to lower the water in this dungeon. Whoa, okay, just don't grab the edge. That's fine. Hey, thanks for blocking me, pawns. That was really cool of you. Yes, the glowing sword and shield is, in fact, an enchantment. See you later, Mari. Good luck. Okay, so now that we got that, does that open this? Ah, fuck. Really? The Alter Slate doesn't do it? Hmm. Alter Slate. Alter Slate. Alter Slate. Lever. We already pulled that. Offering Chamber. First level underground. First level underground. First level underground. Mm, there's this dead end I didn't go down. I'm gonna check that dead end real quick and then come back. Just too narrow to pass through. Not too narrow for me to find money. Let's go. That dead end will be your end. Well, I hope not. Golly. All right, there's got to be a reason for this altar slate. Keep it moving. We'll look around a bit. We'll see what we can find. So that's a dead end until I find an amulet. I already pulled this lever. I've already been down these stairs. But we'll check again just to be sure. Stop! Go away! It's, yeah, it's, it's about the money that we stole and looted along the way. See you later, Poulette! Oh no, you're feeling sick. Oh no. What's this? There's only one solution. You're gonna have to eat something really spicy to prove to your body that you're in charge. <laughs> I don't think the pawns have the key item because I picked up the thing. I need to figure out wherever this altar slate goes. And I'm thinking it's in that sacrificial chamber we were just in. It's the only thing that makes sense to me. No spoilers. If you lose your way, you need but insult. Hmm. There we go. Oh, you're still alive. Interesting. Anyway, I shall restore your health. Hold on. I don't need your help. Thank you. Mm mm mm. So my guess is I missed something in this main chamber. Let's look around a bit. Treasure. Explosives. Why explosives, I wonder? What dis for? Hmm. Hmm. Ah, well. Smoked sriracha. Is that different from regular sriracha? How is it? How, what is smoked sriracha? Ooh, chicken noodle soup. Oh, delicious. 
Well, I think I failed my uh, escort quest for Mercedes anyway, so we've kind of boned ourselves here, gamers. More charcoaly, huh? Didn't even know you could smoke a sauce. I thought you only like smoked meats. I'm real bummed that I don't have whatever the little key is that goes in here. But I guess we'll call it on this dungeon for now. It's not like we can make progress without having um, Mercedes here. So we've kind of just ruined this quest. Oh, well. It was an interesting uh, area to explore, at least. And I got a helmet. And I got to kill a Cyclops. Can you guys fuck off, please? Thank you. Wait a minute, large nut. I'll heal your wounds. Huh. Delicious. Man, I'm getting kind of hungry myself now that I think about it. Christmas cookies reminds me. I have not eaten. Fuck. I mean, I had some pizza rolls. And your ears are cured. Are you guys clean and clothing each other? What are you doing over there? Help. Help. No spoilers, Joel. Very rude. Very rude. If you put away and then retake out your lantern, does it automatically relight it? Even if you're wet? Yep, sure does. Cool. Do I live solely off a diet of pizza rolls and energy drinks? No. I also eat a lot of meat and sometimes bread. The terrain is wild and varied here. We best choose our path carefully. You know it is as wild and varied. All right, that wasn't very nice. I take it back. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. That was that was in, that was inappropriate of me to ask you, Joel. So Fruit stoko? Veggies? What are you asking me right now? What do you want me to eat? Veggies and fruit? Do I look like I eat veggies and fruit? No, I don't think so. I do eat. I eat the occasional delicious steamed veggie. And I mean. I pretend to eat fruit, if that counts for anything. Careless running can leave a fellow out of breath and vulnerable. Wow, golly, thank you for the advice. You're right. Hey, whoa, what are the whoa? Oh yeah, the little nighttime lily things. I'm using controller. Oh, it'll still work. Oh, the more you know. Hello, Skeffy. How else did you get the proper liquids? Great question. You don't like grapes or oranges? I do. I just don't seek them out. But I like them okay, yeah. Man, I'm so bummed. So the little waystone thingies we found, that teleports me back to town, right? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We lost connection. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. Okay, should be better. Exactly. I eat the fruit if it's in front of me. Just drink your fruit? What do you think I can afford a blender? What do you think I'm rich? <laughs> There's a lot of ore out here. Minty honey. Welcome into being a Rusader. Thank you for the membership. Oh, you do think I'm rich. Oh, no. Oh no, you you misinterpreted me. Oh, if I swing Zephyr around really fast, I can make a smoothie. That's a good I'll I'll try that at some point. Do I swallow watermelon seeds? Nope, I spit them out. Bleh. Just squish them with your strong body. With my bare hands and get my hands all sticky? No, thank you. What is a dogma? Well, a dogma 
is a word that means like a prejudice or like an aggressive like hatred for i believe don't you sass me you pawn wow so this whole time i actually had to head south and then up i guess to get to where she wanted me to go she wanted to go over here somewhere sorry mercedes guess it is what it is i got screwed on that one i guess i'm not marrying mercedes what the hell is tuna fruit what no i've never heard of that I eat apple skins, grape skins. I don't really eat watermelon skin. No, do you? Do you eat the skin of the watermelon? Quite the grand structure. A way castle, perhaps. I shall restore your health. Hold on. Hmm. I guess dogma is a belief, but doesn't it mean like a negative belief? Like dogmatic? Never tried kiwi skin either. No. Are you sure? Stigma. I know stigma has a negative connotation as well, but doesn't dogma as well? Because it's dogmatic. It's bad, I think. Oh, without doubt and without proof. Hmm. That checks out. I eat the kiwi skin after hearing you can eat it from Fleon. I think Fleon deceived you. I think Fleon lured you into a trap. Don't you sing at me, you harpy devils! Nope, you missed. Sucks to suck, dude. You missed, you missed. There's a shortcut down this way, so I'm gonna go down this way. Bro, just ignore their song. Don't you trust your senpai? Not as far as I could throw him. Will snatch you and fly. No, they won't. Not if I snatch them first. You, you threw that wrong. You threw that wrong, Clark. Clark, you son of a bitch. We have yes, we have. Okay, cool. You could throw play on pretty far, I guess, though. I mean, yeah, I guess. Play on looks pretty light, right? That's how far. That's that's how far I trust play on. Then, yeah, that exact distance. Is this a shortcut or is this a sure death drop? That's a sure death drop. See ya. Yeah, I, I could throw the archers for sure. I mean, I throw old people in this game like it's shot put. Why couldn't I do the same to Flayon, right? Ow! You fucker. Ooh, cooking it. Battle could be thrown pretty far, too. I don't know. Battle's pretty tall, right? Battle's got to have some sort of body mass going on. Everyone in Tempest is throwable. Even Shinri. Now that is a hot take. Interesting. Keep an eye turned to the shadows. There, Master. Harpies. Leave me alone, Harpies. I just want to live my life. Just trying to make it home, guys. Is that so much to ask? His treacherously steep. Shinri does the most damage when thrown. If Okay, here's the thing. You could probably throw Shinri if, if you got a hold of Shinri's legs or hands and spun in a circle really, really fast until you got centrifugal force and then let go. You might be able to throw Shinri. And there would probably be some damage, I'm not going to lie. I need these harpies to leave me alone. I'm just trying to get back to the city. Please! You missed. That's a good point. If the puppet strings are strong enough, Octavio could throw anyone, but Octavio also has to be strong enough to wrench them off. Unless the strings themselves have autonomous strength, I suppose. 
Hmm. Please fuck off. Don't ever talk to me again, goblins. It's, uh, it's a little lag. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's a lot of lag. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's like a lot of lag! We share these roads with traveling peddlers Duh. and guardsmen. Uh. One second. One second. Oh, we made it home just in time, just before it got dark. That's perfect. You don't want to be out in the field when it gets dark. You get a lot of undead. Hee <laughs> sorry, Mercedes, that you died. No, really, that's my bad, Mercedes. Uh, that's on me. That's on me. All right, well, we made it back to town and got nothing done in the process. That is the shortest person I've ever seen in my life. Wow. You okay there, sport? Are your travel preparations complete? No, I just got here. Thanks for asking, though. We love casting spells right in the middle of an inn. We're so back! Okay, so, hey, guess what? Um, now that we're so back, it's Crim's over is right. Mostly because I've been going for about four hours now, and I am burning thin on my dragon's dogma, um... Rope. My dragon's dogma rope is burning out. <laughs> and so is the internet, apparently. Southern Elysium is not having it right now. Southern Elysium internet said, you're done. You're done, son. See you later, Marlo. Good luck. I know. I know. It's tragic. God damn it. All right. Hold on. Let me fix some stuff. On this side. There we go. Okay, so I got to close my game. Got to set up my OBS. Got to move this over. I got to fix the internet. Southern Elysium Internet, if you don't stop doing this to me, I swear to fuck, it's your birthday today. So glad I'm spending it with you. It's been a great couple of hours. You know what, Candy Verve? I hope that the rest of your birthday is way cooler than that. I hope you go and have a delicious cake and steal whatever it is you want and treat yourself to some great stuff. I hope you have a great birthday. Happy birthday and thank you for the delicious soup. Wait a minute, you're not supposed to give me things on your birthday. But I don't have anything to give you other than uh, talking like an idiot for a while, so... I apologize! <laughs> Thank you for spending a little bit of time with me here uh, on your birthday. You didn't have to do that, but that was cool of you. Um, I am currently losing frames still somehow. I think that's probably some sort of sign that I need to find somebody to raid out to and it looks like uh, Givis Beetle is going right now so we're gonna raid over to Beetle Senpai and by that I mean Beetle uh, we're gonna raid over to Beetle Senpai um, thank you for hanging out for Dragon's Dogma it was a little bit of a weird day we did a lot of side questing uh, I guess we got the main quest done in that one dungeon where poor Alicia died forever and then we killed that troll because he decided to punch out early but it was funny. <laughs> and I'm all about that. So, um, I am going to get the hell out of here. Did I miss somebody else's birthday? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Birthday, birthday, birthday. No, okay, I didn't. We're good. Still good. Cool. Glad to hear it. Hell yeah. Anyway, thank you for hanging out for a bit, gamers. Uh, tomorrow I will be on Haka stream at some time. I want to say it's 8 p.m. EST, but I'm not certain. Don't quote me. Check Hakas. I will not be streaming my side, obviously. 